you can order for the holidays. And remember, coming up at 3 o'clock, David's Great Big Christmas. I have to say it like that so you yeah, know it's I, really big. Yeah, it's good. David's Great Big Christmas. Uh, and we've got brand new items, some really cool things. I was just uh, uh, Instagramming as we came through the door. So we've got a lot <laughs> going on. Let's get busy with our show and stick around. I hope you're hungry. Three big hours of food. Let's do our stretches. And welcome back in, everyone. It's In the Kitchen with David, our countdown to Christmas, and it's our all food edition of In the Kitchen with David. I'm David Venable. It is great to have you shopping with us. Now, every food and holiday decor item today on air and online is for pay or better. So as you're looking ahead to ordering food for the holidays, and we've got all specialty foods today, I want you to think about all the different entertaining you'll do, giving the gift of food. We've got a lot coming your way. Now, I know that many of you have been missing Harry London, and Harry London is back. Nearly 5,000 of these already ordered this season, and we're talking about your choice of a winter box or a Christmas box. And it, what's inside are three pounds of beautiful chocolates, all individually wrapped. Six different varieties. We're going to ship this to you either the week of November 4th or December the 2nd. On any food item today that ships later in the year, all you're making today is your reservation. We don't charge you a dime today. We're not going to bill you until your food actually ships, either in November or December. So if you have any advanced ship weeks, you're not going to pay anything today. All you're doing is locking in the low price and the easy pay if available. And obviously, it's available on everything today. So enjoy that. We're going to get you started with Harry London here in just a little while. Now, I know how many of you love Jimmy the Baker and you love his yeast baked goods. Well, today he brings us his berry filled brioche rolls. This is a sweet yeast bread that is stuffed with either, or I should say, crammed full of blueberry filling. Or raspberry filling. Now you get 12 of these. If you go with the combo, you'll get six and six. So six of the raspberry, six of the blueberry. There's no auto delivery on these, and they'll last in your freezer up to four months. We're shipping either now, if you can't wait, because I'm a total fan of now, 11 4 or 12 2. Please be aware also that we're gonna get you all squared away with four easy payments on these. And Jimmy says if you don't warm these up in your microwave for about five seconds before you eat them, he doesn't wanna talk to you. He said, nope, not even going to talk to you unless you're going to agree to put these in the microwave for five seconds. It's going to change your life, these brioche rolls crammed full of jelly donut or jelly uh, filling. Um, and it's time for the recipe. We are just getting toward the end of the month and we're deliciously vegetarian. Today we're not just deliciously very vegetarian, we're also deliciously vegan with these veggie burgers. And these are really extraordinary. Now, what we're doing inside our food processor here. Is putting our roast vegetables inside. Now look on my sheet pan here because in my uh, sheet pan I have roasted corn cut off the cob. I also have mushrooms. There's some fresh thyme and onions in here. So what we're going to do is take this, and we did this on parchment paper to make it a little easier to pick up. Let's see if I can get this all to roll into the middle. There we are, and then I'll use the paper kind of as a funnel to get this right into the food processor. There we are. Perfect. So all your roasted vegetables go into the food processor. A few that we missed here, I'll scoop up. Clean those off. And in with this goes some salt and pepper. And I believe this is Worcestershire, is that right? Yes. Some black beans. These are canned black beans drained, correct? Yep. And then some oats to bind it. Now we're going to pulse this just until it begins to come together almost like a paste. And then we're going to add some more ingredients later before we form these into our veggie burgers. But I'm going to tell you, once you get all of these ingredients together, and those beans will really help bind this together because they're going, almost going to turn into paste once you begin to food process them. And then later we're going to add in some more great veg to make these even more exciting. And look what's happening here. Once you cook these off, yeah, you'd be hard pressed to know that's not a real burger. Once you bite into it, you're going to be delighted with the flavors and all of the great things happening there. Hey, guys, can we get a um, sanitizing wipe for me to wipe my hands real quick? That'd be great. So, we're going to get all squared away with this. It's our recipe. Search David's recipes on QVC.com and we'll get you all squared away on that. In the meantime, Allie Carr is here for Stacy today. Stacy is away on a well deserved vacation. Allie, we're awfully thrilled to have you. And who's your cute friends behind you? I got some little snow buddies hanging out. Um, a little sneak peek 
to David's great big Christmas that's coming up at 3 p.m. I'm chatting on Facebook, so go to Facebook.com, David Venable QVC, and join the chat, answer questions, maybe even share one of your favorite Landy's candies, treats, because check out this one day only that we have in the show, price for today and today alone. It's a brand new set of 72 pieces of creamy cups in a gift box. Delicious, you may want to get two because you'll eat one and then gift the other. Um, so absolutely yummy, um, even including some of the peppermint truffles, peanut butter cups as well. So Mimi McKenzie is going to be in the house. $25 is that one day only price, so really great opportunity. Lots of sweets and treats and yummy goodness in our three hour show. Um, but David's going to kick it off with something a little global, we should say. Global is a good way to say that. I also want to let you know that our fairy lights from Bethlehem Lights are coming up in the show. We have a special presentation and already over 131,000 sets of the fairy lights have been sold and we've already sold out of a color, I'm told. So the clear with silver wire is gone. So we're going to tell you more about these coming up in a special presentation during In the Kitchen with David today. But right now we're going to come over and kick our, our show off. Remember, it's all food today. And today we begin with the Coronet Cake. And joining me is Esther Vink. Esther, Hi, how hello. are you? Good, how are you? I'm well, thank you. Nice to have Very you here. Very happy to be back. Welcome to In the Kitchen thank with David. You. Good thank to have you, you on our show. I know you've been here one time before because the last time you brought this to QVC, it sold out. That's right. That's that right. was on July the 25th. And I'm going to guess you were in one of our gourmet holiday shows. Is that I right? was. I was. And I'm so happy with the way that it's, it's being received by the QVC audience. Well, that's very so happy. exciting. Well, I can tell you that this is something very special because Coronet cake is directly imported from Denmark. Exactly. These are holiday Swiss rolls in a sampler, but this is not the Swiss roll you buy in an American grocery store. In fact, this is the only place in the United States, QVC is the only place the in the only USA place. to buy these Swiss rolls. Exactly. So let's begin with what a, what is a Swiss roll and, and tell us about where it's from. Well, a Swiss roll is here, I can present it very well. It's a thin layer of sponge cake and it's a European type of sponge cake. So it's we're going to hold sweet. that really still so we can see that. Perfect. But there. please go on. And here you can see it's filled with cream and jam. This one is covered with fondant, with marzipan. So you have the great almond flavor with the apricot jam. And you get two of those. So you're getting actually two of two, every flavor. Two of every flavor. So why don't we just go through the flavors if we can real quickly. So this is? This is a chocolate roll. It's the, the chocolate roll. Yeah, and you get two Christmas. of those. Yes, right? exactly. Then this one? This is strawberry. So two strawberry. Two strawberry. The one you were just showing us? It's Bedenberg. Okay, and we're getting two of those. And then finally the blueberry? The bilberry, yeah. And we're getting two of those as well. Now these will arrive frozen. Obviously they are imported from Denmark. Now once you get these at home, you can pop these into the freezer. They'll last in the freezer how long? Uh, you can you can keep them in the freezer for a year, but they, they won't, won't they, they no. won't last. They <laughs> no, won't of last. Of course not. No. And you're also going to love that this is something that you are able to enjoy uh, for your holiday celebrations or for just any time. Now we're shipping these 11 four and 12 two, so you're choosing either the week ship week of November the fourth or December the second. And November's already popular. There is no auto delivery on this. So it's important to know if you want to get these, stock up on them, stock your freezers. <laughs> but remember, we're not shipping these until November and December, and you're not paying for anything until it ships. So why don't we get busy tasting? What we've done is we've taken these from the freezer and allowed them to thaw. Is that correct? Exactly. Now, exactly. is it best to let them thaw in the refrigerator? No, just on room temperature. Okay, okay. at room just temperature. Just on the counter, yeah. Okay, so this one is the blueberry. That's right. All right, so I'm going to try the blueberry. Try it. Now it's a European blueberry, so it's a little less sweet, mm. but very good in combination with the cream. It melts in your mouth. It does. This is such it does. a delicate cake and so delight. Oh, that's so lovely. Yes. Mm. <laughs> I have to pace myself. I've got three hours of food. <laughs> All right. Now this flavor. This is strawberry. Try that one. Mm. It's a little bit more fresh than the bilberry. Mm. What do you think? I don't know. I would use the word fresh. I would use the word brighter. Brighter. It's a little brighter. Exactly. Mm. Exactly. Oh, you got That's a big punch of strawberry in that. Boy, is that nice. <laughs> mm. Then let's go over to the chocolate. Yes, let's go to the chocolate. Chocolate is always a good idea. Mm -hmm. And that's a there cream filling? It's with cream filling. It's a white cream. Exactly. Mm. It moists it moists very well. This is not the Swiss roll in the grocery store. No, it is not. <laughs> this is the one the one the grocery store wishes it was. <laughs> All right. And then finally? My favorite one, the Bedenberg. So it's covered in marzipan, so you will have the almond flavor. But it also has an apricot jam inside. Ooh. There goes your I almond. <laughs> there comes the topping. Mm. 
And look at what great ideas you can do. It looks great on your holiday table. almond holiday is so table. nice. Mm -hmm. mm, okay. I've had all the flavors. You're getting two of each flavor. How many are gone now, Dan? Over 500 are gone. I think it's time for the first happy dance of our <laughs> Countdown to Christmas show today. These are crazy good. Now, they come in a little cellophane package, is that right? Yes, right here. Oh, they're in a we box, actually, one. covered in cellophane. Exactly. So this is how each individual, here it is. This and they're is all how individually each individual right. roll is going to be packaged. They cut, they arrive frozen. They'll last in your freezer up to a year. Trust me, you're going to take one of these out and you're going to put your, you're going to go in, go in face first. This is fantastic. Also remember that this is directly imported from Denmark. Mm -hmm. And the, the only place in the United States where these Swiss rolls are sold is, is right here. here at QVC. It's right here. You won't find these on any American website. You will not find these on at any grocery store, any specialty store, any uh, any bakery. Only here at QVC. 800 of these are now gone. And I love what you did here by creating some really creative things where you make this look almost like a tree branch. Mm -hmm. The log, yeah. And then you add a little more chocolate to it. You can add to add to this, can't yes, you? Yes, of course. Whipped cream, fresh fruits. Oh. <laughs> you know what, and you know what I love about something like this? Being able to scratch desserts off my to-do list come mm -hmm. the holiday season. Because you know Save what, I don't time. know about you guys, but I am so slammed during the holidays, just with everything I've got to do, then cooking, and then if I gotta make desserts on top of it, I'm like, oh my word. I'm, exactly. There are not, not enough <laughs> hours in the day. So you go ahead and buy these lovely desserts. Now this is not like anything you could buy in an American grocery store because they're not available. So this is something you're going to serve your dinner guests and your holiday family and friends, and they're going to be amazed and impressed, and they're going to think you did a lot of baking. And Esther and the good folks at Coronet Cakes would be happy to let you take the credit. Oh, yes. <laughs> we 1,100 of these are now gone. I need to let you know that brings us to 6,000 for the season. This sold out when we had it on the air, and I believe when you were on in July, that was your first time on. Is that right? Uh, I, I've been twice in July. Twice, but the yes. most recent time you sold out completely. Sold out. So exactly. this is only the third time on the air. Yes. This is a relatively new food product in our uh, family of gourmet food items. And again, you're getting two of the chocolate rolls. We'll go back to the flavors here. Two of the chocolate rolls. Two of these delightful strawberry rolls. I would serve this with a strawberry sauce on top. Oh, wow. And then maybe that a little. That sounds amazing. You know what? Or you know what you could do with this? Do these slices and then make strawberry shortcake out of it. <laughs> like put a layer of strawberries on it, then I whipped love your topping, ideas. then another piece of cake and more strawberries, more whipped topping. Make like a great big old strawberry shortcake. Now, this one is the almond. Is it, what did you call this one? Badenburg. Badenburg. Yes. Okay. And that has the almond flavoring. Almond flavor and apricot inside. Almond and apricot. Yes. And then finally, here's the blueberry with the uh, with the sweet cream inside. Yes, exactly. Two thousand of these are now gone. Do want to remind you that each roll will come individually packaged in cellophane and a box, just like this one. If you want to gift these, that would be perfect exactly. for the holidays. It would. I mean, you put a little bow on this and put it in a neighbor's mailbox. I have a delightful neighbor next door. Her name is Beth. Yeah. And she and her family, and I was there for, I think when they moved in, they had two kids. They now have four. I was there oh, for the wow. birth of two of their kids. <laughs> uh, they're dear friends, and they always look after them. My home when I'm away, and they pull in my packages yeah. for me and whatnot, grab my mail. So, this is the kind of thing that I might put in their mailbox with a bow on it and a little card saying, Thank you for your kindness throughout exactly. the year. Exactly. This is the kind of thing that you would give to your school bus driver, your piano teacher, the kids' teachers or teachers' aides at school. These are very, very popular. 2,200 of these are now gone. Remember, this, like every food item, is on four pay today or better. So be watching for that great easy pay, but don't miss out on these because they are delightful. Directly imported from Denmark, and they are amazing. Esther, thank you very thank much. You. It's a pleasure to it was meet a you. Pleasure. Come back and visit with us oh, again I when will. you can. I will. In the meantime, we're going to check in with Allie, who's got some trivia. In fact, our first trivia question of the show. All right, here it is. Okay, here's our trivia question. How many cacao beans does it take to make just one pound of chocolate? Is it 200, 400, 600, or 800? You can always put in your guess on our Facebook chat on David Venable QVC. Otherwise, stay close because we'll find out. But speaking of chocolate, I think we've got a little Harry London in the house. We do indeed have Harry London in the house, and you have been waiting for it. You've been asking for it, and 
it's back. Harry London has been in business for 97 years. Today they bring us their three pound gift box and you're going to be able to choose the artwork on the box, choosing either winter or Christmas scene, but what's inside is the same for both of those choices. Six different varieties of beautiful Harry London chocolates and confections that are going to absolutely light up your holiday season and we're shipping these either 11 4 12 2. So the order you place today, you're not paying for today. All you're doing is reserving it at the low sale price, locking in your easy pay, and then either the week of November 4th or December 2nd, we'll ship it to you or to whomever you designate. Joining us now is Ed Seabold. Ed, how many years have you been with Harry London? How you doing? 20 years. 20 Can you years. Believe? Nice wow. to have you back, my Yes, friend. great to see you, David. So many people have been asking for this and yes. waiting on it to come in, and we've got it for you. I know that some of you are thinking, well, I, you know, three pounds is great. Could I get six pounds? Order two. That's right. And then Perfect. you got your six pounds and you're ready to roll. That's As right. As we mentioned, Harry London has been in business 97 years. Tell us a bit yes. more about the brand. Yeah, so Harry London actually was a person. He came over from Europe in the early 1900s. He settled in Canton, Ohio. He was a steel worker by trade. Well, around the holidays, he had a great passion for making gourmet artisan European chocolate. He used to do it around the holidays for family and friends. Well, guess what? The demand got to be so great, he said, forget the steel mill. I'm going to make this my lifelong work. <laughs> since and we're 19, glad he did. <laughs> we are since 1922, right out of the heartland. So let's get busy with our varieties yes. and go through, reminding everyone you're getting three total pounds and every piece individually wrapped. Individually wrapped, which is so unique for a gourmet chocolatier. So I'm going to identify them first, and then we're going to come back for a deep Actually, dive. You know, before we do that, I should probably mention the artwork just so folks can see the, oh, the boxes. Oh, they're beautiful. Yeah, so down front, that's the auto delivery. Here we go. This is our um, winter scene, is that right? Yes. Yeah. Here's yes. winter, and then we have one with the Holy Family, and this one is entitled Christmas. Right. Now, if you decide to go, now, the same chocolates are inside both, it's just you get this beautiful art on the box. If you decide without a delivery and decide to get your same assortment coming in in the spring in yes. time for yep. Easter, yep. it'll come in this beautiful spring box. And I would imagine maybe some yes. of the flavors change. Is that right? No, same flavors. Oh, same flavors. Yep, same well, that's flavors. Easy. Okay, yep. fantastic. Thank you. Very easy. Now, thank yes. you for allowing me to do that. Yes. And I'm glad you pointed that out. Those boxes are as elegant as the chocolate. So now we're getting get into the fun part and here. And 300 already gone. Oh yeah, here we go. So the first is that milk chocolate soft caramel present. How appropriate for the holidays in the shape of a present. What do you see on the inside? When I say soft caramel, this is almost a gravy. I'm going to get two of them going here. This is going to be the dueling. Caramels. Look at that. That is pure butter. That's real cream that we use. We still cook our caramel in copper kettles over an open flame, just like we used to do 97 years ago. Look at that. That is not slow motion. That is real time. I'm talking gobs of butter, real fresh cream, whole milk, not powders, and all that goodness since 1922. Well, hello. That's just, just liquid goodness right there. Oh, boy. That's that we liquid call, butter. We call that liquid gold, Or David. gold, yes. There liquid you go. gold. How great okay, is that? Okay, from there we move into. Then, look at this. Again, the outside is as beautiful as the inside. This is our dark chocolate brownie batter. So have you ever licked the batter when you're making homemade brownies? Well, guess what? We have captured that taste profile right in the center of this dark, intense chocolate shell. That, my friends, is to die for. Oh my word! Absolutely. I and my then, whole of course, face in this tray. we are in Ohio, right? The Buckeye Why, State. Ohio? <laughs> Did I ever leave Ohio? Ohio. It's there the you Buckeye go. State. You've got to have a peanut butter Buckeye. There you go. That, of course, is our signature item. That's a peanut butter Buckeye. But let me show you. That peanut butter is just not a dollop on the top. That is a peanut butter fudge that runs all through. And when you marry that up with that Harry London milk chocolate, which is silk and creamy, you got a fantastic flavor profile. Oh, this is great. And that's only oh, three. Let's and that's only four. three. Okay, this was brand new. We launched it last year. This is our butterscotch mm -hmm. caramel. So we have notes of molasses. We have notes of brown sugar. And then that is paired up with that caramel on the inside, oh. which is just absolutely fabulous. And I'll tell you what, there's such synergy and harmony between that milk chocolate components yeah. of the dairy and how it pairs with that caramel. 800 how sets sweet now is gone. That? Then we have our favorites, customer That's right. favorites. Customer favorites. This is sweet and salty. Who doesn't like sweet and salty? The first is our white truffle fudge cluster. Tiny, crunchy, lightly salted pretzel bits immersed in that white truffle fudge uh, confection. And then 
We have the same with the milk chocolate. And look at that. We don't skimp. Look at those pretzel bits. Everyone loves sweet and salty. Perfect. Oh, and so you're going to again choose, and you're getting three pounds of these individually wrapped chocolates. Yes. You'll choose either the Christmas themed box, excuse me, this is winter, winter, or the one with the Holy Family is entitled Christmas. And I know that we don't do a lot of the Holy Family in, in our Christmas decor, so I would encourage those of you who are excited about bringing that motif into your home or giving that as a gift yes. to take full advantage of this is something, that, and it's also something you don't see much of in the at retail. That's right. So this no. is an opportunity for you to pick it up tonight. And of course, for so many of us, this is the reason for the season. And this is your opportunity to pick that up. Now over 1,000 sets are gone. $49.90 is your sale price. But let me remind you, you're not paying for a thing today. All you're doing is reserving your set, Ed. Yes. Because this is all being shipped out either November 2nd or Excuse me, November fourth or December the second. Now we'll bill you once this uh, once this ships. Now, if you're a little concerned that you're never going to remember come November or December what you ordered on the twenty fifth of mm -hmm. August, no fear there either because we'll email you. Once this ships, you'll get an email saying it has shipped, and that'll also let you know your credit card has been billed. This is also a great candidate for bill to ship to. Yes. So if the absolutely. grandkids live in Dallas and you and your husband live in Tallahassee, you can send the chocolates to the kids in Dallas yep. and we'll send the bill to you and an email reminding you when it ships. Right. So you can call them and say, hey, something sweet's coming from Grandma and Granddad. Be, be watching That's the right. front board. Super convenient. So, David, I want to show you how we pack these. So not only are they individually wrapped, but they come in six eight ounce bags also wrapped. So that, you talk about freshness, these will last for about six months, but. Now, December is very, very popular. 1,400 sets are now gone. We are incredibly busy. You've been waiting on these chocolates. They are here. You're not gonna be able to be billed for anything until it actually ships, so reserve what you need, and if it's reserving one, two, or three boxes, then absolutely do that. Throwing these into a bowl on your desk at the office makes you the most popular person in the oh office. Oh my gosh, unbelievable. Going to the craft store and buying some cel Christmas cello bags and then tucking these inside. Perfect. For little gifts for coworkers, for the mail carrier, for the school bus driver, for all the folks you wanna remember, your hair and, hair and nail technician, yep. all those kinds of people. Yep. So please don't miss out on this. We're gonna go to the phones welcoming Marsha and Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Hi, Marcia. How are you? Hi, David. Hi, Ed. Hey, Marcia. How are you doing? I'm doing well. I'm happy that I'm seeing Harry London on the air again. Oh, thanks so much. Absolutely. We're thrilled to have it for you today. And which one did you choose? Well, I haven't ordered this yet. I'm going to, um, but I have ordered every year the Harry London and the, the tins. Right. And I save them because they're so beautiful, and these boxes are gorgeous. Oh, um, thank you so much. You're going to love I, the boxes. I told the operator we have free chocolate stores in uh, Erie, and I order Harry London. And oh, these three chocolate stores are good, but I love Harry London. Well, if I've you live in Erie, you, Marcia, you're not too far. Come visit us in Canton, Ohio. We'll we'll give you the grand tour. I did, and you weren't there because it was the company picnic. Okay. And <laughs> I'm I sorry, to I missed it. Right. But, but the store was beautiful. My husband and I love going to Canton. We've been to Canton uh, three, four times. It is a, it's a wonderful town. And uh, I do plan on coming back to Harry London. I, I would love to meet you in person, Ed. Oh, that's um, great. Thanks, you know, Marcia. It's, look it's look me up. Place. I promise I will roll out the red carpet for you. <laughs> You'll That's love nice. it. Yes, I asked. I said, is that people? No, it's the company picnic today. Oh, oh my <laughs> goodness. Said, okay. What are the odds, right? So yeah. um, so if uh, if you're ordering one of these days, which one will you choose? Will you choose winter or Christmas? I want both. Oh, you want both. Good well, idea. That yeah. is fantastic. And Marcia. Well, I'm a sharer. I have five grandchildren, and they're in school, and so I like to, you know, they, let them, if they want to make little gift bags for their teachers, I put them in my family stocking. <laughs> exactly. Great idea. Well, I'll tell you what we'll do. If you'd like to hold the line, I can give you back to the operator. They'll be happy to place an order for you. We're going to be accepting orders to be shipped out on November the 2nd, excuse me, November 4th or December 2nd. Okay. And David, I met you years ago in the 1550 tour when you came to Erie at Pascal State Park. I remember being in Erie back in the day. That was oh. really, it was in the summertime, I remember. It was the talk of the town. It was so wonderful. And we were, if, if memory serves, we were at a state park, I think. Yeah, Prescott State Park. Pre oh. That's exactly right. Yeah. I remember. Great yes. Place. Great place. And I you did a lot of driving through Erie that day, I remember. You, 
You and Rick Delmeyer and Paul Kelly. Yes, the we had a great you. time. We had a great time. Well, Marsha, what we're going to do is ask you to hold the line. Don't dare hang up. We'll give you right back to the operator. They'll be glad to place your order for both Christmas and winter, okay? Thank you. You're welcome. All right, nice talking to you, Marsha. Take nice care, Marsha. Nice talking to you, Ed. Okay. Hopefully, I'll see you in camp. I hope so soon. Thank you. <laughs> Take care, sweetie. Bye-bye. Right, bye -bye. So we're very, very busy. Nearly 3,000 of these are gone now. And what's so nice about this is now you can think about to whom you'll give this because gifts of food are always appreciated. They're always nice, too, and for those folks that are hard to buy for. Oh, absolutely. So why don't we go through all the varieties again if we can. Yeah, so here and is that. And we're going to begin with that uh, caramel chocolate oh, present. Oh, boy. That's that liquid gold. That Look at that. It's just spilling just out there. Go oh, my gosh. How mm -hmm. good is that? Uh -huh. That is just Fabulous. And for those dark well, chocolate lovers. And I would suggest not biting into this. I would just pop the whole thing in your mouth because otherwise you might be wearing it. Yeah. yeah. Or, or wear a bib. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. Oh, Ed. So good. How good is that? Mm. Doesn't that pair well? You that, that caramel. When you bite into that chocolate, present, and then here comes the caramel, it's like a caramel waterfall. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Oh, my word. I'm and how like buttery. How buttery is that? Mm. You know we use real butter in gobs of it. That's a mess. Okay, that's worth a happy yeah. dance All right, right there. there we Come go. on. Come on. <laughs> mm. Nice. You know what I love about Harry London? A lot of things I love about Harry London, but you don't scrimp on your filling. No, mm. not at all. Not at all. That's what we're known for. And that Ooh. is why, you know, we use the purest, finest ingredients and recipes. These are time honored European recipes <sighs> that go back good. generations. Mm. Okay, let's quickly. Then we have the that rest. dark chocolate brownie batter. How fabulous is that? Of course, that signature. Peanut butter, Buckeye. The I'll best. tell you what, Marshall will come and visit us and I'll load her up on that. <laughs> then we have that butterscotch caramel, and that has got the notes of brown sugar, molasses, and just pairs so well with that milk chocolate shell. Beautiful. And then, of course, sweet and salty is here to stay. Our white uh, pretzel bit so um, cluster, and then our milk chocolate cluster with tiny, crunchy, lightly salted pretzel bits. Ooh. And David, I'd love to show again what uh, about a hundred pieces looks like. Yeah. So either this is the gift for your boss, or you could make, let's say, ten gifts, as you mentioned, for the for teacher, the office. Yeah. for the office, for the folks, for yeah. the coaches, uh, for the caregivers that are taking care of the elderly. And look at that. That is a lot of chocolate. All individually, all individually wrapped, wrapped, wrapped for and freshness. all in beautiful holiday colors, I might add. Just gorgeous. Take a look down front. Here are your two box choices again. This beautiful Christmas. I have 700 Christmas that can ship in November and 1,000 that can ship in December. That is all. In the winter, I have 1,000 in November and 2,000 in December. Please don't wait on these. We're very, very busy. Almost 4,000 ordered in this show. And remember, we do not and will not bill your credit card until these actually ship November the 4th or December the 2nd. Lock in your sale price because these sale prices, Ed, expire end of day Tuesday. Yes. If they make it that far. If they make it, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So be sure and stay online. It's good to have you back, buddy. Great to see you, nice David. To see you, yeah, pal. great to see you. Thank All you. right. We're checking back in with Allie Carr, who's in for Stacy today, and she's got some answers to trivia. I do. Well, it sounds like. Most of our chatters and foodies on Facebook may have gotten this one right. So how many cacao beans does it take to make one pound of chocolate? It's 400. According to www.candyusa.com, each cacao tree lives for 200 years, produces approximately 2,500 beans, but for only 25 years. Got to get in its prime. <laughs> but that's going to be our trivia for today. Hey, keep in mind, we have a one day only from Jimmy the Baker. Think of like the most buttery, rich, delicious sweet dough, and then fill it with freshly baked fruit. Yum. Over 300 have already been spoken for. It's our one day only of the berry filled brioche rolls. You have a choice on this one too. The raspberry, the blueberry, the first time that we've ever done them, that combo. So a really great opportunity as well. $32 and change as our one day only price to get in on the brioche rolls. If you love sweet rolls and butter and fruit, you're going to love these. So don't go anywhere. David will have those coming up in just a little bit. But I'm going to wreck those, food. Allie. I'm going to wreck those. <laughs> I'm sorry. Excuse me. 
just hollering over to my friend Allie, telling her about the brioche rolls with the jelly filling. Now, I'm going to lose what's left of my small mind today, all right? Because we've got those jelly rolls coming up, but right now, Mr. Rostelli, Ray Rostelli is here from Rostelli Meats, and he brings us something that he makes only one time a year. That's it. This is something he makes for the holiday season only. It's his beef Wellington. And I'm going to tell you, this is one of my most favorite meals. And I, these are very difficult to make. And so it's so nice that you have done all the hard work for us. For people who are not entirely aware, mm -hmm. let's go through a Beef Wellington and let them help, help them understand what this is. Yes, so when you actually take a look at this Beef Wellington, so look, what you're seeing here is you're seeing filet mignon, so center cut filet mignon. But then we take a portobello duck cell. So how do we do that? Well, we take this portobello mushroom with some garlic, some onions, some shallots, and of course, red burgundy wine, and we reduce that literally in the saucepan for quite, quite some time. Then, David, we kind of hug the filet. We wrap the filet entirely with this beautiful portobello duck cell, and then we take puff pastry, wrap it around the top. We've done all the work for you. Oh. All you have to do is basically take it out of the package, put it in your oven at 400 degrees for about 30 to 35 minutes. When you reach 130 uh, degree temperature, this is what you're gonna get. You're gonna get a beautiful mushroom duck cell along with that beautiful filet mignon. And that's, you know, I always talk about where we start. And we have to start with the very, very best. So when we start with the filet mignon, what I want you to see, it's an aged filet mignon. It's all center cut. Oh. So critical, right, that we start with the very best ingredients. This is so amazing. Our mushrooms, our onions, our shallots, our onions, roasted garlic, and of course the red wine burgundy really helps <laughs> to reduce down. And that's what makes this so special. And David, we can only do this once a year, so it's really something very okay, special. So having said that, we're going to ship this either in a four or eight count. My producer tells me already the eight count is flying. <clears throat> All right, four and eight count are available for you, and we'll ship them either November 4th or December the 2nd. We do not and will not bill your credit card until these actually ship. Beautiful, I believe these are center cut fillets. They're yes? all center cut center fillets. Center cut yes. fillets <clears throat> that are then beautifully topped with the duck cell. Duck cell is a combination of portobello mushroom, shallot, roasted garlic, and red burgundy wine. Reduce down, reduce down, reduce down until it's almost a paste, right? That's and it. And you smear it on top of the meat, and then you wrap it in this buttery, flaky, unbelievable dough. And then it gets, now, many folks will do just what Ray has done here. It does a little flourish on the top and kind of makes yes. it pretty. <clears throat> um, and then these are baked off. We bake these from frozen, From correct? frozen, very, very simple. David, look, all we do is take them from frozen, put them on a parchment paper. Now in these obviously oven. have cooled a bit, these so we can cooled, handle These are cooled, right? But actually it's pretty warm, but I've got, I've got meat hands, got so chef hands. you know, that's okay. what happens. Um, but that's how simple it is. We've taken all the work out of it for you. In the oven, right out of the oven, and this is what you've got, an incredible centerpiece that just uh, your guests are going to feel like uh, you've been baking for hours and hours and hours and making What this you have product. to know is Jimmy the baker is standing over there salivating. <laughs> and Jimmy, after I taste, I'm going to invite you over, brother. Okay, baby. All right, I'm not going to leave you out. All right, you're going to choose four or eight of these. Our eight count is already flying out the door. This is five easy payments. If you want to do auto delivery, Ray has agreed to make these for you every four months for a year and ship them out. That's something he's doing just for QVC because remember, at his market, he only sells these at Christmas time. So, brand new today. Stock up and save with that eight count. You'll save nine dollars. I can't hardly stand. I've got to go. Have you got a little demi glace? I to put do on have there? a little demi glace to put on there Just with a little make bit it of that duck cell. Special. There you go. All right. <coughs> Here we are. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Just gonna savor all of that. Make sure I swallow it before I do the <laughs> happy dance. There, there it is. <laughs> Woo! All right, boys and girls. <coughs> I don't know how you're budgeting out your money for our show today, but I want you to seriously consider this. We don't do Beef Wellingtons very often at QVC. No. We did them years and years ago. <clears throat> Haven't done them in a long time. Ray makes these only one time a year for his meat shop. This is something he's done for us, for you, for Christmas time. Jimmy, come over here and get some uh, Beef Wellington. Wow, 500 of these are gone. Here you go, James. Jimmy was, oh, was salivating over Man. there over this. All right, what and you think? See, you got a big old bite. See, I like I that see. about you. Not me, You're chipmunking too, aren't you? <laughs> so you can talk, enjoy it all at the same time. So, you want to bake these frozen. Let me tell you why. From a baker's point of view, 
See that puff dough? Beautiful, beautifully executed puff dough. If you bake it frozen, it'll steam better and it'll flake up better. That's so true. don't let them thaw. So don't let them thaw. No, That's put it. them right in frozen. Right from the bag. Right There's from frozen. The bomb. Yes. Woo! All right. Hey, we're getting limited now, and I don't want you to miss out on this. Now, if you want to, I mean, look how gorgeous these are. Now, you're going to cook them to whatever doneness you like. 130 degrees is going to be medium rare. It's going right? to be medium rare. Now, will they continue to cook they as will they rest? They will continue to cook about 10 more degrees once you pull them. But I want you to notice all the all the portobello duck cell that's in there. I mean, that's you get the flavor from the, the burgundy wine and the shallots and the onions and the roasted garlic. You mix that with this portobello and then on top of this incredible center cut filet mignon. And as Jimmy just mentioned, this incredibly beautiful puff pastry. So we've taken what is would be hours <laughs> worth of work for you and literally made it into minutes. It's I want you to think about Christmas Eve package. dinner, Christmas yes. Day dinner. <clears throat> A little departure, perhaps, from tradition. But if you don't want to, you know, depart from your traditions, <clears throat> let this be New Year's Eve. Let this be New Year's Day. Yes. Let this be one of <clears throat> your special meals over the holidays. So you're going to be cooking a lot of meals over the holidays. <clears throat> now, we've got these four or eight count delivering either November 4th or December 2nd. What was that update, Dan? November now is last call. Oh, my goodness. Thank you. Uh, is that in both <clears throat> counts? Yep. And if you want <clears throat> December, I have 304 count. Six dozen eight count. Oh my goodness. These are going very, very quickly. All right, I'm gonna have to have a down home moment with you. Okay, bring that camera, that one over here. Bring it up close. You're about to get a whole lot of DB right up in your TV. All right. Um, this is something very special. This is something that is gonna let everybody at your dinner table know just how much you love them. This is something Ray does one time a year, but he's making it available for us for the holidays. Don't miss out on this. I know it's a bit more of an investment. But the payoff is huge because this is a specialty dish that can be very difficult to make on your own. Ray's done all the work for you. It's fresh. It's gorgeous. Mwah. Get these Wellingtons. Oh, all right. Let me tell you, we've sold out of everything except the four count in December. Oh, and I have 200 you. left. Show real quickly how these come shipped. Everyone individually packaged, so it makes it nice and convenient right out of the package. As Jimmy the Baker Pardon said, me. Pull it right out of here. Put it right in your oven. It is that simple, that convenient. You know, whether it's whether it's you know Christmas Eve or New Year's or just a great dinner party or a gift. You know, if you're looking for a gift for someone really special who's never had something like this, you will just be uh, happy thrilled David. with that. Thrilled happy, with happy, that. happy, happy. <clears throat> I want you to look on the screen there, young man. Oh, thank you so much. Thank I you so that. much, thank my you. man. Pleasure. Mm. <clears throat> you guys are so lucky. Oh, I'm coming to your house. All right, <laughs> fantastic. Thank you, sir. <clears throat> it's time for a one day only. Mm. <clears throat> 400 people have already dialed in for these beautiful, sweet brioche rolls that are filled to the brim with berry filling. This is from Jimmy the Baker, the original scratch baker, the yeast baker that we know and love so well. These are going to rock Ooh. your world. This is to dessert what Beef Wellington is to dinner. I, I that's I'm flattered. Come I on. Flattered. I mean, that this is a homemade yeast roll. This is Jimmy the Baker. You've been a baker how many years? 30, man. 30 years. 30. And you started at the tender age of three. That's right. Okay. Child prodigy. I was six feet tall. And he was taller then. <laughs> and I will tell you that this is extraordinary. You get 12 of these four and a half ounce berry filled brioche rolls. We're calling these a roll, not a donut, because they're so much bigger than a donut. But this is something that is tender, flaky. It's a yeast brioche roll. And then look at that filling. You're going to be able to choose today either. Raspberry filling or blueberry? One of those is new. The blueberry. The blueberry is new. And if you can't decide between the raspberry and the blueberry, we have a combo. So here's what's happening. You choose to have these delivered either right now, my vote, or November the 4th or December the 2nd. Now you can choose all three ship weeks if you want to. And if you do, we're all coming to your house for rolls. <laughs> um, and then these are on four easy payments, as is the case with all food today. And there is no auto delivery, and these will arrive fresh, but can be frozen up to four months. Easy. Now, Easy. Jimmy the Baker, you bake these in paper cups. Tell us why. We bake in paper because paper does not conduct heat. I don't want crusty or or um, 
a hard shell exterior. I want the outside to be as soft as the inside. So that way every single one is soft and gorgeous. Now, when you get these at home, they will ship to you fresh or what's called ambient temperature. Now, when you get them out of the package, and each one is individually packaged, Jimmy just popped that in the microwave for maybe five seconds. All that's going to do is slightly warm the filling and make the brioche even softer and more fantastic. Jimmy, I'm about to die. I've got to have go. some. <laughs> okay. All right. Which one is this? Is this, this the raspberry? This is the raspberry, right. All right. I'm just so gonna, go ahead. Uh, yeah. You can just take this. Here, I'll do this. I'll do this. Go ahead. Okay. Mm, mm, mm. So, this is as compared to the cinnamon. Cinnamon roll. Mm -hmm. I keep going. Again. Oh no! Keep talking. Okay. As opposed, mm -hmm. this is a richer dough. Mm -hmm. More butter than you would find in the cinnamon roll dough. More egg that you'd find in the cinnamon roll. That is by definition what a brioche is. It's a richer dough. We, we, we. <laughs> Come over here. Okay. Come over here. You're a good man. Thank you. I love You're you. Good man. You're a good man. You're a good man. I need you to go right. I'm going left. Okay. We're gonna do a double happy dance. There Come on, we go, get man. it. Get it. Get it. Hands higher. Hands higher. Hands, Hands higher. higher. Hands higher. Come kinda, on. I did it. We're we doing two. Yeah. Oh, I think we did a double. I did a ninja. You finish. guys, this is crazy. <laughs> now they're slightly dusted with cinnamon sugar on top. How does the sugar stick to it? Do you wonder? Is it butter? I think it just might be. Okay, come over here. Let's show you what uh, what Jimmy does so with as, these. So as usual, <laughs> as Alec, you got to go over here, boo. As usual, is as much process as it is recipe about this dough, and just like the raisin bread, which is made with the same dough, by the way, um, the rich brioche the dough. Raspberry. I really struggled to find to, for butter notes to come out in it, and the best way to fight, get those butter notes dunk that bad is boy. to dunk them in the butter after they've been baked. <laughs> Give them a quick dousing and let the butter soak in. And we're going to talk about why this is so important besides the obvious. After that, we're doing the old-fashioned dunk in the cinnamon sugar and coating them. Okay. We're doing that's what the staff is doing with each one. Okay. Now, why is it important then for you to heat these uh, br the brioche up? Because when that butter cools and it let's say it hardens as it should. I want you to get the same butter notes as if this was fresh out of the oven. And the warmth of the microwave will activate the butter, there right? There you go. So Allie has joined us. You've got raspberry, got I've got thing. blueberry. <laughs> Jimmy is dunking uh, dunk brioche rolls as we go. Here we go. Mm -hmm. mm. And the only way to eat these is warm. And my, you can eat them fresh, you so can eat them at ambient. This blueberry is crazy. But it's going to real. And, that, and you've got the raspberry? And we searched. I got sugar all over my lips. This is so good. Oh my word, these mm -hmm. are the best things ever. Mm -hmm. Are you kidding me? Thank you. You know what I'm talking about? I'm talking about Christmas morning. Oh. How about Wednesday morning? <laughs> How about tomorrow morning? All right. Um, now, we yeah, can buddy. ship these now. Yes. We can ship them now. Let me find mm -hmm. my card. Good gravy. I lost what was left of my mind. All right. Um, it's all the butter. We're shipping now 11 4 12 2. I'm told the immediate ship is wildly popular. <laughs> 2,000 of these have now been ordered. Now, this one day only price will only last until end of day today or until the item sells out, whichever happens first. You should know there is no auto delivery on these. Stock up. Um, and you're also going to love that you got them on four pay. When you order November and December today, we do not, will not bill you until they ship. Perfect. And do you know that if you order November or December, your rolls haven't even been baked yet? No it's way. not sitting in a freezer somewhere no because remember, way. they arrive to you fresh. So Jimmy's going to bake them and then ship them. They're going to be that fresh when they arrive at your door. I'm telling you what's the truth. Laurie Shore, do you want do you do you, do you like rolls? Girl, get out of here. I Come like on. Jimmy <laughs> and I like rolls. So right. it's a win-win. Here's a clean fork. Thank you, sir. So I hope and these aren't too warm. Is that the blueberry? That's the blueberry. And that's Lord. the new one you said? This is the oh new good, one, I yes. want to try that. Try. Okay. Do just I get makes that? Blueberry. Do you want me to trade you for it? blow on. I think I might have nuked it a little just too long. Just make sure it's not too hot. Mm, no, that's good. How's that wow. working out? Wow. I should not have to talk. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Mm. I should big, just see. Bright, gorgeous blueberry. Um, you came to the kitchen and you made these fresh, is what it tastes like. Right, that's like what I Like when I, I buy them, I bought Jimmy, you came on over and did the bacon right, right there. I want right them to there. feel like just mm. out of the air. Thank oven. you. We'll see you back for pretzels. All right, see you right, later. Thanks, Jimmy. Blueberry. All right, are bomb. if you want these delivered now, I have 500 combo, 300 blueberry, and 150 in the raspberry. Few more to go in the future ships, but I will tell you, if you can't decide between blueberry and raspberry, and I totally get it if you can't, then get the combo and you'll get six and six. These are amazing. These will last in your freezer up to four months. Bear in mind that Jimmy will not ship these until he bakes them fresh. That's right. And then he rockets them out to you and they'll arrive fresh and room temperature. Eat them right away, you'd have a hard time not eating the whole box. 
And if you can practice some self control, pop them in the freezer. They'll last there for four months. Easy. Okay, this one again is the blueberry. That's the blueberry right there. Can you cut a raspberry too? Absolutely, absolutely. Let's we pop might, one. Let's, might need a, a warmer let's raspberry. Let's warm one up. Well, while you do that, I'll just have a little more of those blueberries. So then. let's talk about the dough because I saw I just pulled apart one with that didn't have the side that didn't have any jelly filling, and I wanted you to see the richness and the fluffiness of this dough. I love this dough. Probably mm. about rendition 19A, I think it was. And I literally went through about 20 or 30 different renditions of brioche. I want this dough to stand up in the microwave. I don't want it to disintegrate. Right. We had to, we had to try different flour, different proteins, yes. and all that stuff. Come up with a dough that stands up to a microwave, but yet when it gets heated, it just melts sufficiently. Go ahead, you can grab that. I'll cut it open for you. Both the jams, again, this raspberry jam is what I call top of the line jam because it has the actual, wow, that was, it has the, <laughs> that's the angel singing in case you were wondering. It, no, no, no. This is like gourmet berry filling. So there's seeds in the jam. I look for seeds. Some people don't like seeds in the jam. When I see seeds, that means they are using real raspberries. It's not, it's not uh, flavored corn syrup like you find in, in, let's say, jelly donuts. It is a real way. jam. So go ahead. Where are you And going? you know what else happens here? After he bakes them and they cool, he dunks them in melted butter. The way God intended. Every every single and one of them. And then takes the glistening butter soaked roll and rolls it in cinnamon sugar. Again, where is the angel chorus? And then he wraps I them up I, and he ships them to your doorstep. And they the are crammed chorus, full right? of either blueberry or raspberry filling. Can you imagine on Christmas Eve morning when the kids are so excited they want to jump out of their skin, they still got a whole nother day to go? Serve them this with a cold glass of milk. It's your special Christmas don um, Christmas roll. We'll call these rolls. I hate to call them donuts because they this is like no donut I've ever had. And I will tell you, five thousand are gone now. If you want the immediate ship, I have only blueberry, and 150 left. I also have, I believe it's November the fourth, and December the second. Those shipments are both half gone. Remember, this price will expire end of day today or when the item sells out, whichever comes first. Look at this. Jimmy puts it into the butter oh, pool. Look, David, it fell by look, accident. Look, it fell by accident <laughs> back into the melted butter pool. Yeah, it did. I'm going to do a swan dive in the butter pool. And then you roll it in the cinnamon sugar, and then he puts it in a little cello bag, and he puts it in a box and ships it to your doorstep. And yeah. you open it up and you're like, this smells like it was baked yesterday because it probably was. And then you take it out of that paper and you pop it into the microwave for about five seconds. Don't do more than that because you'll turn that filling to lava. You could you could actually do if it depends on how mushy you like it. Five seconds will bring out the butter notes. Ten uh, seconds. Ten seconds will get it softer. 15 to 20 seconds will get it mushy. So it depends on how you like it. I like mine just slightly warm because I've been known to dunk. Now, dunk. To dunk, man. To dunk, these dunk these. Now, this is a brioche in coffee or milk or the, more dunk butter? Dunk in coffee. Dunk it in coffee if you can. It's. I used to, I had a great pastry chef who, when we made our own croissants, used to dip his croissants in coffee. I thought he was crazy. The, the difference between this and a donut. I would dip it in cold milk. You just might. Cold milk. You just now might. Now wash it down with cold milk. Mm. Oh. But it's heating. It Boys brings and out girls those butter notes. And children of all ages. <laughs> we have sold out of the immediate ship completely. If you want November, I have 1,500 left, and that's less than half. And a few more to go around in December. And we remember, we have raspberry, we have blueberry, and if you can't decide between the two, you go combo. Just make sure you go with one of them. And if you want to send these to someone who's really impossible to buy for, but you know they eat, and most people do, at least they should, um, then this is your opportunity to enjoy and get these out as gifts. Remember, if you order the November, December ship weeks, we will not bill your credit card until this actually ships. Jimmy the Baker, you outdone yourself. Thank you, young man. Thank you Crazy very good. much. Thank you. We're going to check in with Miss Allie who's got a little mention of what's coming up in our show, and then we're going to take a short break. But first, here's the delightful Allie Carr. <laughs> well, some items in the show 
We bent over backwards, or I should say, Mrs. Printables bent over backwards to make sure we could have this for you all weekend. So here's what's happening. We have, you know and love them, right? For maybe their caramel apples. Well, here's your caramel and chocolate pretzels. They come with these adorable little cracker boxes. You get 18, you can easily make six gifts as well, $36.72. Delicious pretzel, caramel, and chocolate. You get dark chocolate, white chocolate, and milk chocolate. We've sold over 30,000 this season with free shipping and handling. You've got to get these while we have them. They ship out November 2nd or November 4th. How about the 18th? I'll try that again, <laughs> November 18th, and then December 2nd. So a really great opportunity to have some fabulous gifts. So that's still to come in our three hour food show, including some other exciting things. But right after this show, it's getting big. We've got David's Great Big Christmas at 3 p.m. David? Put your yes. hands over your mouth like this. Cup it a little bit and say, David's Great Big Christmas. David's Great Big Christmas. Was that that's, good? That was better. Was that okay? That was better. Okay, so that's good. <laughs> and we have some little elves I'll right beside you. There, look, I got my I got my snowman, my elves. Oh, and some of you have been asking, the little bird behind me, can you see her? We got huge that's your flower elves. Bars. That's also coming up in the show, too. Look at my little guy right here. Little. He's not They're so little. Ginormous. They're almost like Alice. That's like my height. This is like your littles at home. <laughs> exactly. So say it with me, ready? David's Great, great Big, big Christmas. Christmas. Three o'clock. <laughs> All right. We'll take a short break. We're back in moments. I hope y'all are hungry. Join David Venable as he shares some of his holiday favorites during David's Great Big Christmas. Be there Sunday at 3 p.m. Eastern on QVC. Now when you share what you love about QVC, you can get rewarded by being a part of QVC's brand new advocate program, Q Crew. Share your faves from QVC.com on social with your family and friends, and when someone shops your link, you get a commission. To find out more, search Q Crew on QVC.com. Fall in love with the season's hottest fashion, shoes, bags, beauty, and more from the brands and designers you love as we kick off our month-long celebration a little early. Fall Style Guide Kickoff, tonight at midnight Eastern and throughout the day tomorrow. Treat yourself to a new handbag this fall, like this nylon hobo bag from Dooney & Burke. Find your favorite Monday at midnight Eastern on QVC. David plus comfort food. Fall for David. Fall for cooking. Fall for Q. Well, we are back. It's In the Kitchen with David. It's Countdown to Christmas. You see Allie over there in the cook nook. We've got a busy, busy show. We're barely an hour into our three-hour show. It's all food today, foodie friends, and it's all for the holidays at special pricing, and every food and home decor item for the holidays is for pay or better today. So we're awfully excited about that as well. Welcome back in. I'm David Venable. You're watching In the Kitchen with David. It's now time to bring in some old world Italian meatballs. I'm not going to say Italian style, because that would suggest that they're trying to pretend to be right, Italian meatballs. Right, right, right. These are Italian Legit. meatballs. And this man comes by it honestly because his last name is Mancini. That sounds a little bit Italian to me. How are you? Good to see Hi, you. Hi, everybody. This is Daniel Mancini, and he brings to us his 100 count wow. mini meatball wow. collection. And in addition to the seven and a half pounds of meatballs you're getting in the 100 piece count, you're also going to get an extra pound of sauce. Yes. Now you may choose to do 100 in the all beef. You may do 100 in the all turkey. We do not have a combo choice today. This is sale priced at $69. These will arrive frozen. You can keep them in your freezer for how long, Dan? Up to a year. Up to a year. If you're going to serve these, they're already fully cooked. So let's say you're going to serve these for dinner tonight. In the morning before you leave for the office, grab a bag out of the freezer, put yeah, it put into it in the, the refrigerator, refrigerator, and when you get home, squeeze the contents into a saucepan and let it come to temperature. That's it. 15 minutes when that home smells like grandma's cooking, you're ready to roll. This is the only known picture yes. of Daniel and his grandmother. Yes. And this is her recipe. Correct. She brought it here from Italy in 1921, along with a bunch of other recipes that we bring here to QVC. Oh, my word. So when you talk about her meatballs, we're talking about these quality fresh yes. ingredients. 
Tell us about this. So we start with your choice of the beef or the turkey. Now, again, both proteins we source only from the United States. Great. And then we add, and this is a, a, a big holiday item around my grandmother's house always, and that's what we brought here. So then we add Pecorino Romano cheese. Yum. Asiago cheese. Yes. And Parmesan cheese. Please. Into the mix, along with whole eggs, onions, parsley, a little bit of garlic, some onion, fresh, you know, fresh parsley like this, and then the sauce, David, which is the secret, and that's why we add that extra pound, because everyone's been asking for it. Sure. We start with whole plum tomatoes that are crushed, Yum. olive oil, onion, garlic, bay leaf, and that's it. Now, we're shipping these either November the 4th or December the 2nd. Yes. You will not, and we will not, and do not bill you until this actually ships. So say you're having a party and you want Perfect. to do a great big slow cooker full of meatballs, yep. put out slider rolls or just toothpicks and let them take yeah, a Yeah, as easy that. as that. You're getting seven and a half pounds of the meatballs. They come in these individual yes. bags. So you're right? getting five pouches like this that have 20 meatballs and sauce. Right. Then you get the additional pound of the sauce. So you just take out what you need. David, give a beef a try. Oh, you won't right? ask me but once. There you go. And, and a extra cheese you know what here. I did here, David? A good way to show what you're able to do with the meatballs we have here today, we made 25 bowls of pasta with meatballs. Look. First of all, <laughs> homemade, old school. Melt in your mouth. Yes. Tender. Yes. These are not machine made. No, are they? we roll them, hand and roll. And they hand roll these, and they don't overwork them. Correct. What do we what do we know to be true about meatballs and meatloaf and burgers, right? Yes. The yes. The more you work them, the tougher Correct. the meat can become. So yes. these are not overworked. They're rolled just until they take shape. That's right. And then they are cooked and then frozen. Yes. Please don't miss these because these are this. amazing. You look inside there. I mean, that is tender. It's juicy. It's absolutely juicy. And it's swimming in Mama Mancini's Correct. homemade sauce. Look at this. And the turkey, David, you know, we start with the white meat, predominantly a little bit of dark meat just to give a little pop of flavor. And it's the same thing. You're going to see the moisture. You're going to see all the cheese. Look at, look at this. You're going to see all the cheeses. But you know what I did here, which I think is so important to show, we, we can make 25 mm. bowls that have four. Turkey is amazing. Look at this. You could have four meatballs and sauce had you opened them all. Or I love this because the holiday, you know, that time of the year, November and December, we got the games happening. You can make 25 jumbo subs. Love it. Or sliders for a party. You can make 100 sliders. And, you know, I love, my mom has a Christmas party. You all heard me say this every yes. year. She has a, a party for her friends from church and in her neighborhood. And she always uses QVC food. So she's ordering little things, you know, here and there. And she has served your meatballs before. Yes, I know. You say hit. she's a, a fan she of She loves them. these mini meatballs because they go such a long way. They're really great appetizers. And when she's only having a couple of folks over, she has a group of girlfriends that call themselves the Golden Girls. Ah. And they come over and they play cards at her house. And then she'll serve a little appetizers. Sometimes if she's got some leftovers, she'll do leftover meatballs, right? Perfect. So she can serve those as appetizers. These are amazing. Please don't miss and, out and on that, these. And that's They're a perfect. great point, David, because, you know, you're having people uh, drop over. Now, could you imagine on your holiday, and I have two Temptations platters here, bringing this beautiful Temptations platter to the table. Right. Look at this, full of meatballs and spaghetti. Over here, we made a baked ziti where we just put the meatballs on top. And then we spiralize some vegetables and put turkey meatballs on it for during the week. So obviously great for a holiday gathering, but also for the guests that pop over during the week. Ooh. And imagine instead of sending, looking for something to send someone for the holidays, send them grandma, grandma's dinner. Mm, what a great gift. They will love you. These are perfect. I'm Isn't that delicious? More cheese. Absolutely. Ooh, look at that. There you go. Thank a little you, more cheese on there for I you. I love that. And again, you're getting 100 of these. We've never done 100. This is, you know, that, that special mm. for Christmas. Wow. These are so amazing. Please don't miss these. Everybody is excited about them. And how many gone now, Dan? Over 700 in this show. We're going to invite all of you to stay, uh, stay on the line. And remember, nothing bills until it actually ships. Right. You're choosing either November 4th or December the 2nd. Daniel Mancini, Thank a great you very pleasure, much. sir. Good Thank to have you. you back. Thank you, everybody. Okay, I'm going to be getting ready for today's special value, uh, which is about 10 minutes away, which gives us just enough time for Allie to present an item that we did not think we were going to have for this show. As of Friday night, it was taken out of the show. Allie, what happened? 
you, the angels were singing. You heard them. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. The whole some, chorus. Well, some magic happened. Um, should we say it's a Christmas miracle uh, from Mrs. Prindables? I think a lot of exhausted Mrs. Prindables people would say yes. Yeah, it was it, give you a little we've been backstory on around. This one. First of all, um, Lori Shore, who brings us Mrs. Prindables Thanks, for almost Allie. ten Thanks years, for having me here. we know for their like legendary caramel apples, the most delicious caramel. Well, here you're getting a set of eighteen pretzels bathed in chocolate and caramel for a delicious decadent treat. You're gonna get the white chocolate, the milk chocolate, and the dark chocolate. Yeah. And then how adorable are these little Christmas crackers for $36.72 yeah. and free shipping and handling. We had these on our Fry Yay, Holly Yay's show. They were crazy, crazy popular. A lot of you picking up more than one. And then we're excited that we were able to go to Mrs. Printable and say, please bring us more. Why? Because you are loving this configuration because Lori, now, You've got you've got six gifts for about six dollars and twelve cents. Exactly. This is what we've been working on all weekend is making sure we talked with our suppliers when it came to our boxes, reallocating our production time so that we can produce these gourmet chocolate caramel pretzel rods right before they ship out to you. So you're getting six of these wow gifts. So when they arrive, you're gonna see these six cracker, Christmas cracker style boxes. Inside each one will be three of these chocolate caramel pretzel rods. We took them out of the boxes. They come individually wrapped. We took them out of the wrapping that you see right here so that you could get a sense of the goodness that you're gonna be biting into and enjoying or the people that you give these to. These are crunchy, salty, fresh pretzel rods that we dunk first in that same caramel that we made famous with our pioneering gourmet caramel apples. And then we enrobe them in the milk chocolate with the sprinkles, the white chocolate with the sprinkles, and the dark chocolate. Six of each, so you get one of each and every single innovative, cool gift box. Well, and since we launched these on Friday, we sold 9,000. We since launched we brought them, them technically in July. So 30,000 have been spoken oh, for since goodness. then for the yeah. season. 9,000 on Friday. On Friday. Yeah, so these are crazy, crazy popular. And a lot of it has to do with not only how delicious Mrs. Printables is, but you know that you are getting fresh ingredients. Couple things to keep in mind. These will ship out for you in November, so November 18th. And then they'll also ship out, you have the option to take them um, for December 2nd. So you can kind of break that up. Here's my suggestion. I get both, because what's gonna happen, you're gonna buy them and think November, perfect, now I have my gifts early, and then you'll eat them all. <laughs> Don't you know it? You know that ha that happens every year in my house with Halloween candy and Christmas treats. So Lori, let's walk through again kind of yeah. the yummy ingredients, and we've got three different chocolates. Well, in first of the all, I think most of us have tried chocolate covered pretzels. Mm -hmm. I actually remember, not to the day, but definitely to the year, the first time I tried, you know, my first ever yeah. chocolate covered pretzel. That salty, sweet, yummy goodness. So just imagine using the best ingredients for that and then adding that layer of caramel. And you can come on in and take a look at this one. I picked one of the three flavors that you get. Remember, you get six white chocolate, six milk chocolate, and six dark chocolate of these individually wrapped and then boxed pretzel rods we dunk that crunchy salty pretzel a lot of us just love our pretzels by themselves so that is yummy mm -hmm. then we dunk it in the same caramel that we've made famous on our caramel apples and then enrobe them in the chocolate and finally top them with the festive looking sprinkles they're so delicious and they look so pretty i mean the caramel and the festive to gift these two it's super impressive yeah. as well um just to give you an idea in this show alone i believe we've sold over over a thousand now okay it was 800 so but then by the time i got to tell you now it's, yeah. <laughs> now it's a thousand Thank you. but remember you could break this up as six gifts too yeah. because you're getting these adorable little crackers and i'll show you too if you're someone who's a little oh, like good. wrapping inclined Mm -hmm. Or disinclined? It's a, it, 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 thank you. Yes, yeah, both. It's just a little because I like twist. it both. Yeah, right. But you could put a cute little bow. But it looks it's such a beautiful presentation. There's no fancy folding, yeah. and then right inside are going to be your three pretzels. They'll come loaded yeah. with the three: your milk chocolate, your dark chocolate, and your white chocolate. Now, I'm not going to judge. And Lori Shore, <laughs> you I know you're not, not going to judge if. You mix and match a little. The recipient's not going to know they're getting three milk when you took all the dark. Yeah. <laughs> okay, no judgment. What would you take if you were going to take a flavor? Okay, it depends. Um, I love to have the dark chocolate mm. with a cup of coffee. Right. Ditto. And we've got the Harry and David coffee coming up. Like to me, there's just something. Mm. Something. But then yeah. if I want that caramel really flavor strong and really something sweet, yeah. I go for the white chocolate. Can, you know what? That's we could have snacks together and both of, be happy. Can I take one of these? Yeah, Lori? definitely. Take, okay. You can take a full one if you want. Indeed. Yes. 
So really, what we were also something that Ali mm. and I were talking about that we have as in common is young kids. Oh. Mm, and the okay. people, the, the more, once you start having kids, you realize it really is a village, this community that we're in. Totally. And to know, my always dilemma is, what can I get that my budget can accommodate that can really mm -hmm. show these people in the, my children's lives and my life that I really appreciate yeah. them, that they're as special as the gift is, right? right? Between my two kids, three teachers in each class, because there's assistants, that's six. Right. That's six people. I've got the school directors. Right? Secretary. Other people that we help around. School secretary. Yeah. There's... It's a handful, and this would be such a special treat. Oh, First of all, what a fun treat, too, for my kids. Giving you a little bit of an update. We have it available. Over 2,000 have already been spoken for. You can get them in November. November 18th, we'll ship them out to you, or December 2nd. Now, let me remind you, too, because I've got two kids. We're a very budget-conscious family. These aren't going to charge. You're not going to be charged until these ship Great out. Point. Right? So if you're thinking, oh, gosh, you know what? I've already picked up on a few things this month. I'm not sure if I could quite do it. Well, you're not going to get charged until they're shipped. Right, so it's a really great opportunity why so many of you love reserving yours and why Mrs. Printables was able to bend over backwards and make this happen because truth be told, they haven't even been made yet. Only the ones for our set. So Lori, let's walk through what you're getting. Good. Because it's six chocolate covered pretzels with caramel and your festive Actually, sprinkles. Actually, a total of 18. Oh, yeah, you're right, 18. Six of each six flavor. Gifts. Thank you. There are a lot of numbers to juggle yeah, on this one. Six, 18, three, you, four. <laughs> I'll tell you what, each one of us, when we look at these six wow gifts, are going to be thinking of different uses and different people. Because the cool thing about these, you don't even have to nail down who you're going to give these to. This is good for women and men. This is good for adults and children. This is good as a standalone gift. This is good if you want to personalize that gift card. But it's three different design, two designs, two two of each, inspired by those Christmas cracker boxes that are just so festive and fun and bring back so many great memories. Inside each box are three of these individually wrapped gourmet chocolate caramel pretzel rods, one in milk chocolate, one in white chocolate, and one in dark chocolate. You're just reserving your order at this point. It won't be until right before they ship out to you that we're gonna take those crunchy salty pretzels, dunk them in that made from scratch buttery caramel and then enrobe them in those three kinds of chocolate and finally top them with those happy festive sprinkles. Yeah, you're gonna love having these, whether it's for gifts or treats just for you. Because look at this, because there's six different crackers with the three pretzels inside, this is just over a $6 gift. And how impressive. Now remember, the white, the dark, and the milk chocolate will all come in each. You can rearrange. Yeah. <laughs> as, as I might. <laughs> if I were giving this to my sister, I'd put just white in hers. Oh, okay. And I would, you know, I could rearrange them according to the people, you know, yeah. that I'm giving them to. But what I love too is if maybe you're giving them to someone you don't so know cute. personally all that well. Good You've got point. all three kinds of chocolate. They're going to find yeah. something they love. And when you combine it with caramel and pretzel, man, Heaven? I think I like them all. Um, <laughs> caramel's probably one of my favorite treats. Listen, in this show alone, I'm going to give you a little bit of an update. Over 3,000 have already been spoken so for. You can get them November 18th shipped out to you or also December 12th. I would suggest last week, or I should say on Friday during our Facebook chat, there was a gal by the name of Marianne. She came back to try and get more after because she was probably eating some herself as I would too. Yes. Um, and they were sold out. Right. That's so right. this year she bought six. So and what I would do, buy buy a little bit more than you think you need, maybe two sets. And I okay. remember talking to that caller, or was it the person it online? Was on, Facebook. on Facebook. And love that she find when she did get them, she got them with innovative boxes for the very yeah. first time ever Super with this fun. item. So yeah. And so M six four two one four is gonna us? be your item number. Look at this. Should I get us coffee? Is that what you're thinking of yeah, right now? Yeah, I need, yeah, I'm saving this for my coffee. The dark chocolate and coffee. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Perfect little snack. Hey, listen to this. Whether you are fireside this fall, or maybe even watching one of your favorite holiday movies, we have got the perfect snack coming up from Germac. How delicious are these nut mixes? Now you're gonna get a full assortment. Sold out the last day that they were presented. This is six of the mini jars. We've had over 50,000 for this season and they were sold out the last time. Okay, stop. These are mini cheesecake truffles. They're perfect like fall mixes if you're like doing a fire, a bonfire, or even then into the holidays. Absolutely delicious. I might need to crack this one open. Okay, <laughs> coming up next, David has a presentation of our today's special value from Bethlehem Lights. It's going to bring us a little sparkle and holiday cheer. Let's check it out.
One of the biggest trends in holiday decorating has become the fairy light. Now, we turn to our premier lighting brand, Bethlehem Lights, when we want to do this on QVC. We did this a year ago and it blew the roof off the place and we took last year's model and made it better. We made the strand longer, we put more lights on it, we improved the battery life up to 64% and you have responded in huge numbers. Since kickoff last night, we have now taken orders for 139,000 sets and during In the Kitchen with David already, over 5,000 have already been spoken for. We have outlined our ladder here. We have wrapped them around our wreaths. We've decorated trees on the front porch. You're going to put these anywhere and everywhere, inside, outside. You're never going to worry about these because they're completely weather safe. And you're going to love that the batteries last longer, the lights are more plentiful. You've got tons of different modes to set these on and they're going to change the way you decorate your home. We're so excited to have these back for you as a value of the day and thrilled to have a chance during In the Kitchen with David today to show them to you because a lot of you are going to be decorating your kitchens and you might even use these in table centerpieces when you're making that big holiday meal. Now I'm going to make my way back inside as you take a look at some gorgeous, gorgeous ideas here for centerpieces, but we're thrilled to have these back for you. You're going to find these not only for Christmas but also for Halloween and harvest because we've got all the colors you could possibly need. Now I will tell you, we began the day with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine different colorways. One of our colorways has already sold out. It sold out before noon Eastern time. That means if any color sells out, any more sell out, like the other one, it'll come off the table. We have no advanced order. Trust me when I tell you, we clean Bethlehem lights out. <laughs> All right? They absolutely turned these out for us, and we took every single set we could get. And you're getting four strands in this set as a today's special value. Chad Johnston is our Bethlehem lights guy. How many years now? David, 19. 19 I know. years. I remember when you guys did these last year. Yes. And you uh, met with our buying team, and our buying team said, okay, Chad, if you're going to bring these lights back next year, <laughs> they're going to have to be even better. So you're going to have to improve them. And you're thinking to yourself, my goodness, how do we improve on that? Right. It was already so, so popular last year. But you and your team and the folks at Bethlehem were actually able to take last year's perfect today's special value and make it even better. And make it better. So one of the things that Bethlehem Lights worked on in the off season yeah. was a brand new patented technology in our battery box, which we introduced in July with our greenery today's special value. Sure. Basically, it's allowing us to give more lights, add more lights, make them longer, make them brighter, and get better battery life. The number one, actually the number one complaint with wire lights or fairy lights is I ordered them, I got them at home, I didn't get enough, they sold out. The number two complaint is yep. I turn them on and they go dead too quickly. Yep. We increased the battery life from 245 hours to 400 at the same brightness, tested to 750, and we made more lights on each strand. Now, before we go into each of our choices here, I just want to ask some quick questions. Okay. Last year, each strand was eight feet long. Correct. This year, they are 10 feet. Correct. Last year, they were bright. Yes. This year, you made them brighter. Correct. Last year, you had how many lights per strand? 24. This year, how many do you have? 30. 30. And did we include four strands in the offer last year? No. So last year was three. This, this year, year was it's four. four. So basically it was 72 lights last year versus 120 lights this and year. And when you say you, you made the battery life longer, yes. how much longer? 64% exactly. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So everything you loved about last year's is now even better, bolder, bigger, longer, lasts longer, you even get more strands, and I think you can see why this has been the wild success it's been, and you're going to get a remote with every strand that you or every strand you get in the set. Correct. So if you get four strands in the set, you get four remotes. Correct. No, no, one, you, no, no, I'm sorry, you get one remote per set. So you oh, get but one if you buy per multiple four. sets, you'll get those multiple remotes, remotes will work all the same. Yes, right? and if you've had a Bethlehem Lights light strand with a remote in the past, this year's will still work for that. So let's go through our color choices. Okay. And what we did is we wrapped them around these frosted cylinders so you'd be able to see not only the lights, but also the wire, which is shapeable and moldable. Correct. Right? So this color is called purple. That's not, I'm going to move my cup out of the way. So 
Now most limited is purple, 8,000 left. And that's brand new for this year? Brand new. Then I've got it for you here in, are we calling this, this one? This is teal. Teal, thank you. And this is more like, this is like sea coast. This is like seashell. This is sea shore. glass. Sea glass. Yes. Perfect. Then I've got amber. Now, amber's going to be great for Halloween, for harvest, for Thanksgiving. Perfect for all those. Yes, exactly. Now, if you want a straight up harvest strand, then we've got one here that would be great, again, for Halloween or Thanksgiving. And that's the harvest multi. Harvest multi. Then I've got it for you in red and green. Is that right? Yes, correct. And then I've got it here in... The traditional holiday multi. Holiday multi. Yep. And then this one is our clear with gold wire? Yes. So we have two clears, and within the clears, you need to just pick... Everything else, you pick the color light. In the clears, you pick the color wire. So you can see here, this is the gold wire. And here, this is the green wire. And the reason why we have two different color wires, because there's two different ways you can use this. If you want to decorate where this blends in to maybe your white mantle or your white column. Under a glass hurricane. Or under glass shade. hurricane. Or you want it to complement any silvers and golds, this is your one. If you're decorating with foliage, greenery, wreaths, outdoor shrubs, and you want it to blend in, then you get this one with the green. Holy mackerel, these are amazing. Now we sold out of the clear with the silver wire earlier, but I think you'd be hard pressed to tell the difference between this gold and clear, gold wire with clear lights, because it is so, so similar. And if you are disappointed that that other one sold out, I think most people have figured out that this is very similar because it's now over half gone for the day. Well, and I'll tell you one more thing. I changed out all the displays on the mantle, which were in the silver, and I changed it to gold, and it doesn't look any different than it looked earlier. Does this look different from the, I mean, even when we come in close, I mean, if you get right on it, you can see, okay, well, that, that wire looks a little bit yellowish. But boy, from a distance, you'd be hard pressed to be able to figure it out. And that looks like stars that have been captured under glass. But what if you wanted to make them morph? <laughs> what if you wanted to make them blink? What if you wanted to make them do all kinds of cool light patterns? Every touch of the remote gives you a different light pattern with all of these strands. Uh, to say we're busy now doesn't begin to tell the story. Our phone lines have lit up like these lights have lit up. Um, how many gone now in this show? 8,000 in this show. Wow. 8,000 are gone. Here's your value story. If you went to retail to try to buy all four of these light strands with the remote, one remote per four strands. Thank you for clearing that up. Yes. 6641 is what you'd pay. We are 3645 less, but with free shipping, we're a whisper away from $40 less than retail. Delivered to your front door. Now, Chad, can I put these in, uh, now these can go indoor, outdoor, so I don't have to worry about moisture or water. Nothing. Right? They're totally outdoor safe. The battery box can get rained on. It can get snowed on. The only thing we ask you to do is not submerse the battery box in a, in a bucket of water. Um, however, the light strand itself can go in water. Oh, really? Yeah, so if you have real plants and you want to put the light strands in real plants with real water in it, just take the battery box and tuck it on the outside. Dan, you said something and I missed it. I'm sorry. Over 9,000 are now gone in this show. Amazing. And almost everybody is buying more than one set because here's one set, you guys. Look right here. This is one set of today's special value. You get four of the 10-foot strands. Last year, they were eight feet. This year, they're 10. Last year, we gave you three. Now we're giving you four. Last year they were eight feet long. This year they're 10 feet long. Last year they were less bright. This year they are brighter. Last year the batteries didn't last as long. This year the batteries last 64% longer. <laughs> yes. That's nuts. So this is what you're ordering and you're ordering multiples. These can go inside, outside. The light strands can go underwater. The boxes should not be submerged. However, if your box is out under six or seven feet, uh, I was going to say feet, heaven, heaven forbid, well, six or seven feet of snow, or yes. six or seven inches of snow, I should say. They'll still work. You'll be fine. I've had callers from Minnesota saying they've been under three feet of snow and their lights still somehow come on underneath <laughs> the snow with the battery box under there. I love these. I love this because invariably you have some breakage with ornaments and then after a while you don't have enough to put on the tree. So what do you do with the six or seven you have left? Or you want to decorate inside maybe an artificial pumpkin you buy. Great way to make it cool and spooky, right? Yeah, absolutely. And think about it right now. Like I was telling, saying this earlier, 
Um, these fairy micro lights are totally on trend and even though we introduced them 10 years ago here on QVC, we are the pioneers. They continue to get more and more popular every year and as they do, Bethlehem Lights figures out how to make them better every single year. Now Chad, in this one window, is that one set? This is one set. So now, you get look what four. happened in this window. That looks like you hired a professional holiday decorator yes. to come to your house and create this starry motif in your window. Now, as good as this looks on the inside, imagine what it's going to look like to people who are walking down the sidewalk or driving past your home. I know. And by the way, all we did was put the battery box on the ledge on the bottom and up here, we, it's, it's like floral wire. So all we did is tie it around the rod. The curtain rod. Uh, yeah. And, it, and the boxes are down here on the windowsill. And, we, and, and by the way, they're 10 feet long. So if you have a little extra, you can wrap it up and do what we just did there, depending on the size of your and window. And if you've got some shears like this, then you can enjoy the look inside as well as folks who are driving by or walking by outside. I think this is fantastic. Look here in the middle of the table. Now, I don't know if you've priced glassware like this lately, but this glassware is super affordable in home stores. Yeah, absolutely. And um, so I'm always amazed by, the, by how affordable glass pieces can be. So go out and, and, and invest in some glass pieces and maybe some pretty things you pick up or knickknacks at the craft store, and then mix and match with lights. Now, I'm going to shut it off, and here's the cool part. During the day, it's just a beautiful display. And then when your timer comes on, it just adds to it. And so we're decorating right here with the gold wire on gold, so it sort of blends in and you don't even see the wire. But if you want to decorate with reds and greens, it now becomes an accent and looks fantastic. Look what you did over here, and I think this is brilliant. We did more glass pieces on the mantle, which you can clearly see are great. Do you have a fireplace, either a faux fireplace, or you have one that is sealed or you don't use anymore? Wrap gorgeous birch logs in these lights. We'll come in close so you can see this. And you can even make it glisten so it's almost like the fire is going in the fireplace. Look what we did here with just a bundle of birch wood. Uh, and by the way, we only used two strands. So if you're wondering how many come, you're getting four strands. That look right there is two. I'm facing the remote on the logs and I can easily just change the features. Let me update you now that over 14,000 sets have been ordered during In the Kitchen with David now. We are super, super busy. This item will not be in David's Great Big Christmas. And I was, and I know why they didn't, because the lights themselves are small and everything, and that show is oversized. I wanted them to put it in there because it's a great big value. <laughs> and, um, and it's bigger than we've ever done in longer battery it's life. It's a great big value. I could but, make that argument. <laughs> but I'll tell you, it is in the, uh, in the we, we will show and mention it during nice. Big Christmas. So you'll, you'll actually be able to order it during that show, too. But don't wait until then, because I don't want you to miss out on your color. We've already sold out one color. That was the clear with the silver wire. Um, the next most limited is the purple which is here, so don't miss out. I have 7,500 left in the purple, and when they're gone, they're gonna be gone for good. This is teal, and this is amber. Now, let's move over to our Harvest Multi. This is what we're calling Red and Green Multi. This is Holiday Multi. This is clear with gold wire, wildly popular. In fact, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go out on a limb here and probably say the most popular in this presentation. Okay. And then we've got the clear with the green wire. And that's nice if you're wrapping this around greenery. Up until today, we've never offered clear in any other look than this. This is a traditional way. Even that will disappear. But if you're decorating with any type of foliage, greenery, wreaths, garlands, you name it, you, this is actually the one to get because the green will literally disappear. It's invisible. You guys come back here because there's just more great ideas back here. And uh, again, our value story with the free shipping, we're almost $40 less than mm -hmm. retail on the set. $40 less than retail. How many of you have these beautiful lanterns that we have been selling on QVC for quite some time now? Put a cluster of the fairy light wi uh, uh, wired lights inside your lanterns and watch that whole look change. And by the way, that's just one strand. Look what we did over here. We put them in a, little, uh, in a little tree, in a little burlap sack. We put them in more lanterns. We wrapped an old sled that's probably been sitting in your garage for decades. This is incredible. We'll come in a little closer so you can see some of these cool ideas. This is what makes these so different and so extraordinary. Please don't uh, wait on these because we are very, very popular. I'm busy and these are very popular. 17,000 are now gone. Wow.
So that brings us to 150,000 gone on the day. Everybody stay tuned because we have so much more to share with you in the remainder of In the Kitchen with David. We're in all food section, then David's Great Big Christmas at three o'clock Eastern time. And remember, this is a great big value. So I hope you're going to be able to get yours and stay on the line. As I love to say, don't dare hang up. Dan, how many are gone now in this show? Nearly 18,000 just in this show. <laughs> Please stay on the line. We're going to get you all squared away. And Allie, we're, uh, we're going to light up your life, darling. Oh, we're going to light it up. <laughs> David, thank you. Hey, well, we've got some trivia that's a little nutty, so check this out. What brightly dyed red nut were sold in penny vending machines during the Depression by the Germac company? Was it walnuts, cashews, pistachios, or peanuts? Stay close to find out the answer. But you know, we're chatting on David's Facebook page and so many of you absolutely love and adore watching him. Well, if you can't get enough, here's a really cool opportunity where he brings the one, uh, one of his latest cookbooks to life in his brand new mini series on YouTube. So you can go to youtube.com slash in the kitchen HQ. It's called Half Homemade. Let's check it out. When it comes to macaroni and cheese, I'm the big kid who never grew up. I love it. I love it baked. I love it on the stovetop. But it can take a while to make really good mac and cheese, so I thought, why don't we come up with a recipe that utilizes a pressure cooker? Join David Venable as he shares some of his holiday favorites during David's Great Big Christmas. Be there Sunday at 3 p.m. Eastern on QVC. Fall in love with the season's hottest fashion, shoes, bags, beauty, and more. From the brands and designers you love, as we kick off our month-long celebration a little early. Fall Style Guide Kickoff, tonight at midnight Eastern and throughout the day tomorrow. Get it now. Pay over time. No extra charge with Easy Pay. You can use it on everything. Yes, everything. All the great brands you love and new products you'll discover. So why wait? It's easy pay every day. Step up your fall fashion game with must-have fashions and shoes from Sam Edelman. Find your new favorites on Monday at 1 a.m. Eastern on QVC. We are back with more, and I know a lot of you are still on the line for our Today's Special Value, and I'm going to invite you to stay there. Just keep QVC.com and your mobile apps handy, because we've now sold 20,000 sets of Today's Special Value. So that's lighting up our phone lines, and this Germac is going to send us absolutely into orbit. Yeah. We're going to end up way up near Jupiter, I think, when, when it's I all said so. and done. Exactly. Christy Fletcher joins me now. Our Germac representative for how many years now, dear? Hello, I've been here uh, since 2010. Since, so, so nine, nine years, years. Nine years. So in QVC years, it's sort of like dog years. I'm only nine years old. Exactly. Isn't that great? You're nine years old. <laughs> it's true. I'm nine it's years true. old in QVC years. All right, Angel, it's good to have you back. Mm. Hey, oh, you brought us hug. a mix that has been, oh Insane. my word, crazy popular. We kicked this off, if, I, if memory serves me, over the Christmas in July yes. time period. Yes, we did. Ready Brand for new. this? 57,000 ordered oh, for the season. Gracious. And that was just since July. Okay, 57,000. Okay, someone come get Mimi and walk her out of the studio. <laughs> okay, she's over there a little crazier than normal. See, Jill's coming to get you. And Jill doesn't play. Mm. See? <laughs> Now she's going to deal with you. All right, now let's get right into this because what we're talking about is we're shipping this on October the 14th, November the 4th, or December the 2nd. So, Miss Christie, none of this. Is going to be billed until it actually ships. Right. But what you're doing today is you're locking in your reservation and adding to the, what do we say, 56, 7,000 ordered since July. Unbelievable. You get six mini jars and there are six different combinations to talk about. So let's go back to our first one. Okay. Because this is brand new this season and I'm awfully excited about strawberry cheesecake. Strawberry cheesecake with black. Uh, dark chocolate, rather, dark chocolate uh, chunks in here. And so we'll go down to the front and uh, I'll show you. This is actually cheesecake truffle. There is cream cheese in there. So that tastes like real, 
real cheesecake in there. And then we have our beautiful batch roasted uh, cashews, our dark chocolate truffles, mm -hmm. our gorgeous batch roasted almonds, and then here's your strawberry that rounds out that strawberry mm. cheesecake truffle with dark chocolate chunks. Gorgeous. That is new. That's one of the new ones. We have three new ones, and that's one of the reasons you fell in love with so it. So inside much. this white chocolate is cream cheese. There's cream cheese. It's sweetened, but it's, but it's not white chocolate. It is cream. It's it's just like the way you make cream cheese. It's a cream. It's a oh, the whole a, thing is cream cheese. Yeah, the whole thing is 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 a is a cheesecake truffle. It tastes just like cheesecake. It it's really so does. It's and delicious. then if you grab one of those and put it with the strawberry, the strawberry, you're just gonna pass out. Please don't do that yet. <laughs> and there he went. There he goes. <laughs> Big man's down. Big man's down. All right. So, first one was the strawberry cheesecake. Uh huh. This, this one. This one is golden apple cinnamon bun gourmet medley. Seriously, that's the second new one. And we start with these golden apple mini cups at the front, and you describe them as something that tastes like apple pie. Yes, it they is, take like little apple little, pies. It's a little bit caramelly and apple gooey inside those beautiful creamy mini cups that we sliced open a few there so you can see them. And then we have pumpkin seeds in there. We have apple. And that's this is very important because our apple, you can still it still has the skin on it. It has some cinnamon in there. So that's adding more cinnamon for you. And then honey roasted cinnamon bun sesame oh, sticks. No, I ain't playing here. Mm. I'm not playing at all. I'm gonna bring Ali Carson this And then apple. we have and then we have our batch roasted cashews in that one. So that is our golden apple cinnamon bun gourmet medley. The second new one that we have. Three new ones this year, and you love your new ones. Mm. So here we go with the third new one. This is Jingle Bell Crunch. And don't forget your labels. I love that you're, thank you so much for those beautiful shots because the labels jingle are all. Bell, jingle, jingle Bell, Jingle Bell, Jingle Bell crunch. crunch. And there's a reason. It, it, it's all about the crunch in this one. Another, again, the third new one. We'll start at the front with one of your favorites, cinnamon praline peanuts. So okay? good. They're so delicious, candy-ish. Then we have a dark chocolate coated pretzel balls. We have batch roasted peanuts. We have chortles in there. Those are little mini cookies. Uh, more crunchy, cookie crunchy, and then honey roasted sesame sticks. So that's all crunch right there. That's your jingle bell crunch. Then we get into uh, the fireside. The caramel walnut fireside blend was introduced last November, and it immediately became a favorite. Pretty much every time we put it on the air, it just flew out the door. This is the first time in this set that you're seeing it in a mini jar. So this is just for our countdown to Christmas and for our Christmas in July that we introduced mm -hmm. it. And here's what's so different. This is such a beautiful, different mix. You have blueberries in here, the only mix that we're selling right now that we have gorgeous blueberries from the Pacific Northwest. You have sea salt caramel drops. You have beautiful cranberries that complement our nuts so well. And then we have glazed walnuts. That is a specialty item, those glazed walnuts. We don't have those in any other mix. We have white chocolate chunks and then our batch roasted almonds. So that, that's a lovely mix. Again, it's pretty, and you fell in love with it last November, and so we had to put it in this set. And then, well, it's Rudy's blend. You can't do Christmas without Rudy. And look how cute Our he is. Our particularly conspicuous colored nosed reindeer. <laughs> yes, I think he looks familiar to you. and He ought to. And he's smiling at you. And look at the colors in this one. This is Jane Tracy's favorite. Well, and you know why? Jane's maiden name is Rudolph, and her dad's name... Her late father's name was Sylvester, but nobody called him Sylvester. They called him we Rudy. called him Rudy. They called him Rudy. Yeah, so and she called him Rudy. And when I met him, I called him Rudy. Yeah. So, and I knew Rudy very well. God rest his soul. What's a soul? Such a sweet man. God bless him. And, and I'll show you what put, puts Rudy all together here. Yogurt covered raisins. Look how thick that yogurt is. Nice, creamy. It tastes like ice cream. Batch roasted peanuts. Big, beautiful chocolate covered pretzels, mini pretzels. They you know are, my producer just noticed? What? And those yogurt covered raisins? What? You got about 50% yogurt, 50% raisin. Exactly. It's a pretty it's even balanced. mix right There's there. Germac is all about balance in everything we do. And then we have mm. these candy coated gems with gourmet milk chocolate inside and all in those lovely Christmas colors. That's Here Rudy. comes Rudy Claus. Here, Here comes Rudy, Rudy Claus. Claus. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And this one we introduced last year during Christmas in July. This is Holiday Cheer Butterscotch Blend. Oh, fun. It's the only mix that we have butterscotch drops in, and you fell in love with it new last year, so we brought it back for you. 
And down here in front, these lovely creamy butterscotch drops, batch roasted peanuts, our beautiful bright colorful cranberries, batch roasted cashews, and huge jumbo flame raisins in here. 2,000 sets gone in this oh, show. Yeah. Now let me review with you again when these are shipping. Uh, the first shipment is October the 14th. The second shipment is November the 4th. And the third and final shipment will be December the 12th. Excuse me, December the 2nd. When we started uh, offering these was back in July. Since that time, nearly 60,000 ordered. Unreal. But not a one of those people have been billed yet. Because they're all going to be billed when these ship, either in October, November, or December. I want you to think about Bill 2, Ship 2, and sending these as gifts. I want you to send a couple sets to yourself, put a ribbon around the throat of the uh, jar the way uh, Christy has done here, and give these as individual gifts to all the people you want to remember Lovely, for the holidays. Perfect gifts. Look at that. And it's perfect. just perfect because this is what it's all about. We've got a great opportunity for you to bring home a really marvelous gift. Do it on four easy payments with the free shipping and handling. If you're not going to see that special someone over Christmas, then send it to them and we'll send the bill to you. If you're worried that you're not going to remember that you ordered this back on August the 25th and then it gets shipped sometime in December, we we're going to send you an email. We're not going to leave you flap it in the Christmas frost. No. <laughs> what we're going to do is send you an email saying, hey, remember that thing you ordered back on the 25th of August? It's shipping. We build your card. And it's on the way. If you're sending it to someone else, give them a call and say something sweet's gonna be landing on your doorstep in a couple days. Keep an eye out for it. So, this has been super, super popular. This mix made just for QVC. These mini jars you, you don't find, see. Right. Yeah. I didn't mean to interrupt you, but Please, you're, no, but you're it's right. Fine. No, you, cannot, you can't even find them on germac.com. You cannot find them anywhere but right here on the QVC. 3,000 are now gone. Now, you know I do this every show. I love it. It's my favorite part the Tower of Germac. The Tower of Germac. There's three. <laughs> it's like Jermac Jenga. Makes me a little nervous. There's four. Nobody move. <laughs> Mimi, don't blow on it. <laughs> All right. That's a lot of Jermac. There's six of them. And look at the variety. Wood, wood, wood. It's like on Food Network when you finish the, uh, finish the, the food. Hands up. <laughs> Hands, up. Right. Hands, Hands up. up. Time's up. Time's up. <laughs> All right, I'm going to put this back down before Mimi shakes the table. <laughs> All right. You all know who Mimi is. I keep talking about Mimi McKenzie. She's over there. She's a troublemaker. <laughs> She's our foodie friend. Well, some people call her that. I call her troublemaker. <clears throat> all right, now let's remind you that this is four easy payments on your credit card and free shipping and handling. How many gone now, Dan? 4,000 in this show. We are very, very busy. Lots and lots of you are saying, you know what? That would be a great gift for my mail carrier. I'd oh. love to take that to the kid's school bus driver because my little one started first grade last year and he or she was so nice to my little one who was scared to go to school for the That's first important. year. You know, because, you know, the, you, mom and dad, you walk the little ones down the school bus and they get on the bus and the doors close and there are a bunch of kids on there they may, may or may not know. I bet the school bus driver goes a long way to make the little ones feel very That's comfortable. Very important so remember job. those important people because they, 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 they do a very important job for our kids. So this is what it's all about, taking care of the people that you want to remember at the holiday season with something more than just a greeting card. That's right. And, yeah, and, and it, again, something you can't find anywhere else but right here. So people will say, goodness gracious, where did you get this? Where can I find this? Well, you can only find it here at the QVC. And I love and it that you call it the QVC. The QVC, like Mimi. My grandma used to call like it you, that. Like your Mimi. When my dad's mom was alive, <laughs> when I first started at QVC, she couldn't sleep in the middle of the night, and I was working in the overnight, so she mm -hmm. would watch me. And then she'd call and leave a message on my answering machine, Tell and it was like she, she was this. writing a note. She'd say, Dave, she taught me in this very whiny southern voice. She said, Dave, I saw you on the QVC last night. I would like that frying pan. Call me. And then she went, Mimi, like she was signing a note. And then hung up the phone. And then like she this hung is up the Mimi. phone. Click. Call yeah. me. And then she went, Mimi, and hung up the phone. <laughs> like I wouldn't know who it was. Yeah. I wonder where he got his personality. Uh, I adored her. <laughs> I adored her. She lived to be 97 years old. God rest her soul. Oh my word. So, uh, and she taught me a lot about cooking too. Yeah, she was. Uh, I talk oh, about her in my cookbooks. Mimi. Yeah, Mimi was awesome. Pretty, pretty, pretty. So we are very, very busy. Uh, 5,000 now gone in this show. We're very, uh, we're very excited that we can do this for you on four easy payments and free shipping. Let me review again. Now, this sold out the last day presented, and we were able to uh, guarantee more quantity per ship week.
Okay. And so that was really exciting. Um, I don't have that sold out story, Dan, but maybe you do and I don't. Okay, fantastic. Well, then you were paying attention to the production meeting more than more than me. Yeah, fantastic. Wonder I remember how that, happened. that day. It was you and I. It was, well, and it you, you think I remember? I yeah, think exactly. You remember me? I can't tell Aww. you what I had for dinner last night. All right, so um, we're shipping this. I did write this down. Um, October the fourteenth, November the fourth, or December the second. Those are your three ship weeks. We will not be billing your credit card until this actually ships out, either in October, November, or December. Think about bill to ship to, send these anywhere you need to go, four easy payments, and we're going to get you all squared away with a unique blend of Germac that was made just for QVC in That's these right. smaller mini jars. And we're very, very busy. Now, 6,000 in this show, add that to what's been ordered since launch. Oh. 63,000 for the season. And that's not Thank individual so jars. That's 63,000 sets, sets of six. Yeah. How about that, Angel? Thank you. You come Thank here. You, so much. you sweet thing. Yeah. We appreciate you. Thank you. Oh, I my girl. appreciate you and I appreciate you. We Love appreciate you. everybody for supporting this fantastic brand. And you know what? That didn't happen by accident. Y'all make a really, really top shelf mix. Thank you. That's Thank really you. marvelous. We, we work Ooh. hard for you. And, and we appreciate it. Let's say hello to Miss Ali Carr, who is here today for Stacy. Ali, what's happening? Hey, will you ready for the uh, answer to our Germac trivia question? I will say, Christy had it right. So here it is. What brightly dyed red nut was sold in penny vending machines during the Depression by the Germac company? The answer, pistachios. According to Germac.com, red pistachios were named red lip pistachios and fueled the ongoing debate of pistachio preference, natural or red. Hmm. David, you didn't even think you'd have like a beauty item. A pistachios. <laughs> What, um, what brightly dried red nuts were sold in penny vending machines during the Depression by the Germac company? Pistachios. Red lip pistachios. See, when you asked that question, I was walking from the other studio, so I didn't see it because I wasn't near a monitor. Wow, red lip. Have you ever heard of such a thing? But it sounds mm. good. Well, yummy. Red. There you mm -hmm. go. Get a little lip color. <laughs> right from the pistachios. Uh, this is Mary Eckenrode, the fun baker from hey. Cheryl's. Great to have you How back. Are you? And I understand you just completed a really exciting trip. Didn't I did you? to Alaska for two weeks. It was amazing. I saw all your pictures on amazing. Instagram. I felt yes. like I was there with you and your family. Yes. It was really Thank fantastic. You. Thank you. So Mary is back with Cheryl's 36 piece holiday grand cookie box. Now, like so many of the items today, we're shipping these either November 4th or December the 2nd. When you order this today, you're getting the same cookies inside as an assortment, but the same assortment comes in each of our three artwork boxes. Exactly. So let's come up here and just real quickly point out that this one is called City Tree Scene. Mm -hmm. This one is Winter Scene. And this one is called Fireplace Scene. But what's inside is even more special than the artwork. It is. And like David said, the assortment is the same in every box. So we have a lot of new stuff in this assortment. First of all, our full-size gingerbread shortbread men. You're going to get four of each of these. Then you're going to get two of the exclusive cookies only found in this box and in QVC, the marshmallow cocoa and the sugar peppermint cookie. Then, David, you're getting 18 of our vanilla buttercream frosted cutout cookies, half of that vanilla buttercream that you love and that's your favorite. And then the brand new chocolate chip cookie, what we did is we put Belgium chocolate in here semi-sweet and milk chocolate in this chocolate chip cookie, brand new. And then your favorite classic now is oatmeal raisins, so we put that in. So lots of new, two exclusive, four new cookies total. And all individually wrapped. Right. So when these come to your door, every cookie is individually wrapped. They also arrive um, ambient temperature, meaning room temperature, is that right? Right, correct. But I can freeze these? Yes, you can freeze them up to six months. Okay. And Oh, here we are, the sugar cookie. I have to do, look at this. Peppermint sugar cookie. Look at that. Peppermint throughout the cookie. And then we oh. put that extra little bonus of sprinkles on the bottom and chunks do of I, white chocolate. I was going to say, do I spy white chocolate? Yes. Chunks of white chocolate oh, in there. So we, we took your favorite, mm. one of your favorites, old fashioned sugar mm -hmm. cookie, and put something a little extra in mm. there. That's some holiday goodness right there. Mm. Oh, those are yummy. Yummy? Yeah. Really good. Oh, and that's an exclusive. 
Only QVC? on QVC. Only at QVC. And then the other one is the Cocoa Marshmallow. What I love about this is see these pieces of white chocolate in there? These are marshmallow flavor. Marshmallow but what's flavor. what's on top of the old nonpareils, Oh, right? yeah. And nonpareils on top. So yummy. And look at this. So soft. Rich, dark cocoa. All that yummy real butter in there. And then those chunks of white chocolate in there that tastes like marshmallow. Mm. Then, look at this. This guy is our little shortbread guy, and he is full size now, individually wrapped. What is great about our shortbread is it's not hard. It's more of a crispy shortbread, and we have fresh ginger in there, lots of butter in there. And in our shortbread cookies, there's no eggs. So I know a lot of folks out there, their kids are allergic to eggs, can't have eggs. Shortbread cookie is great for them. And, and a brand new chocolate, chocolate chip cookie. Brand new chocolate chip cookie. So three kinds of chocolate in there. Belgium chocolate, chunks of Belgium chocolate, semi-sweet, and milk chocolate. And throughout this entire cookie, look at those chunks of chocolate in there. Amazing. This cookie is so good. I'm so excited for everyone to try this. Now, we're shipping either November 4th or December 2nd. Most of you are ordering that December ship week. But remember, these come in a beautiful decorated box. Now, the same assortment of cookies will come in all three decorated boxes. Exactly. But you can see just how beautiful these boxes are when they are all zhuzhed up and ready ready. for people to enjoy once these arrive. You've got the beautiful little uh, city scene see. back behind. Right. So, this one is fireplace scene. This one's called fireplace scene. Mm -hmm. So Christmas Eve by the fire, beautiful. Then we've got it for you in the winter scene, most popular. And then I've got it for you in the city tree scene. Thanks. Since our winter scene is most popular, let me just read this quickly. Dashing through the snow and skating on the pond, rolling up a snowman while the cardinal sings along. Making snowy angels while our toes and fingers freeze and listening to carols that are floating on the breeze. We spend our day so merrily in a wonderland we roam, while the love and joy inside our house keeps welcoming us home. Isn't that so heartwarming? I think that's just lovely. And there's a message on each and every box. And they're and all I different. Love, and they're all different. And yeah. I love this box. And it is our most popular one. And uh, more importantly, I love what's inside because you're getting eight of your favorite, our vanilla buttercream frosted cutout cookie, two new exclusive cookies, only a QVC. And then you're getting that new chocolate chip cookie and that oatmeal raisin cookie and gingerbread man. And if we could take cookie baking off your list this year, would that save you some time? Oh, yeah. oh my word, would it ever. And to be able to put these out, you know, because Santa's going to be mighty hungry when he gets to your house. He is. And the quality of the cookies, well, let's just say has an impact. Yeah. Uh, has an impact on the gifts. Yeah. And you yeah. know what? There's so many, there's 36 of them, David, so you can make little goodie bags up. Send this to, you know, your grandkids and kids that are out of town, all individually wrapped. I mean, this is what's great. Individually wrapped, you can take it to work, put it in your pocketbook, mid-morning snack. All the ingredients and everything are on the back for you. And if you notice, the new cookies, they're not even in the Cheryl's wrapper. That's how new they are, but they will for, be for Christmas. For when, uh, when you receive them. I can yes. tell you now that in this presentation, we've taken orders for... Well over a thousand sets are gone. Everybody is excited about the sale price. Get yours while the getting is good. Enjoy that easy pay. And of course, free shipping and handling. Yes. Thank you, Angel. Thanks, David. Appreciate you so much. Thanks, everyone. Okay, we are following along our month-long theme of deliciously vegetarian. And today I'm making my veggie burgers. Now, earlier in the food processor, we processed up our roasted mushrooms, onion, thyme, and corn. And then we added in some black beans and some oatmeal for binding, as well as some salt, pepper, and I think a little Worcestershire. Yeah. Now we're going to take that mixture, that thick mixture, and fold it into some more veg. And this is shredded carrots, parsley, and scallions. So this is all vegan. There's no meat or dairy product in this at all. So all this is going to go in here. Now, if I were home, I would wash my hands and I would get in here with my hands and I'd form these and get these all together. I'm not going to take time to get it completely mixed because I won't have time to do it thoroughly. And I would be able to do it much more completely with my hands, but I just don't have running water right here to wash after I'm done. But you get the idea. You're going to form this and mix this all up. Then you're going to form these into patties, okay? 
And these patties are very easy to pull together, and you can see the vegetable as you come in closer. You can see the carrots and the scallions and the corn and all the goodies in there. And then you're going to saute these up nice and quick in a little olive oil on a skillet on top of the stove. And then serve it on your favorite brioche roll with bib lettuce and your favorite toppings. And you've got a fantastic veggie burger that is not that mystery meat burger you buy in the supermarket. No, it is not. You know, those in the supermarket half the time are gray. Who's going to eat a gray veggie burger? What's in there? What vegetable is gray? I don't think there is one. No. Search David's Recipes to find my uh, recipe there, and you'll be able to find that as well as all the other recipes on my site. In fact, over a thousand are listed on the site there, each with a color photo, and you can check all those out for you. In the meantime, 400 already spoken for. We're talking Landy's candies, but not the pretzels you're used to. These are the creamy cups in a gift box, and already 400 sets ordered since we mentioned these off the top of the show. It's a one day only value, meaning you have only until the end of day today to get this item because it will only last at that price until end of day or until the item sells out, whichever comes first. This is $25.90. You're getting 72 pieces of these mini, mini creamy cups in a gift box. Joining us is Mimi <laughs> McKenzie. She's our representative from Landy's Candies. Landy's Candies has been around how long, darling? About 35 years. We're and family you, you've owned You've been operated. with them how long? Um, for about seven years. About seven years. Yes, exactly. Good to have you back, <laughs> Troublemaker. All right. Thank you so much. Well, what's a show without me? Me <laughs> is always unpredictable. It's true. All right, so what we know the... Landy's most for these yes. pretzels, these beautiful um, caramel filled pretzels. That's right. This is going to be that same attention to detail, but in a creamy cup. That's absolutely. Absolutely right, David. You know, we are all about the chocolate. We're all about the sweet and salty. The ultimate creamy cup collection is not your kids' candy. It is rich European inspired chocolate. It is butter toffee on the inside. It's peppermint truffle on the inside. It is peanut butter, Virginia ground roasted peanut butter. No salt, no sugar added on the inside. We thought, why can't that dry, flaky peanut butter cup that you can get in a grocery store be so much better? And we actually did that with the Ultimate Creamy Cup collection, David. Well, you've got lots of different varieties. And look at the cute gift boxes these come in. Yes, so three boxes, 24 each. 24 in each box. And you're going to love that we can do all this for you and ship out to you either November the 4th or December the 2nd. Yes. So this will be just in time for holiday gift giving or for merrymaking. Yes, that's absolutely right, David. So perfect for hostess gifts, perfect for yourself. We were all eating them behind the set stage. What I love about this, David, is that there isn't one ultimate creamy cup on the market today. Any peanut butter cup, any anything with a topping on it. So our process includes making the fabulous shell and then filling it and stuffing it and capping it, as you say, and then topping it. So you're getting that beautiful, rich peanut butter from Virginia Roasted Peanuts. You are getting the Virginia Roasted Peanuts on top with a hit of sea salt. And of course, that luxurious, creamy chocolate all the way around. Oh, yeah! I stole one of the white chocolate ones with the caramel. You know, one was missing before the show, mm -hmm. and I was wondering, was that you? Because Michelle wasn't very pleased. It <laughs> might have been a drive-by. Michelle, it was a drive -by. Michelle is our prep chef, and Michelle She's and I gorgeous. are tight. So sweet. <laughs> So, Michelle, if, if Michelle thinks I took it, she's all right with it. Trust me. All right. So, remember, this is the white chocolate with that beautiful caramel inside. That's right. So buttery, so smooth, so creamy, and it has the beautiful non pareils on the top. You see it right there. So, it's perfect for a buffet table. It's perfect just to pop in your mouth. Our white chocolate, David, is quite unique because it has a... It has a nice undertone of vanilla, not too strong, but it does have that vanilla. So it's mm. not chalky, it's not flaky. It is really just so smooth and creamy. It's, it's the my ultimate. <laughs> and then, of course, can't have the holidays without dark chocolate peppermint. We make our own peppermint truffle ganache on the inside. You can see it right there. Super smooth, super creamy. And then, of course, the crushed candy canes on top of that dark chocolate. The dark chocolate is just a step above semi-sweet, so you are not getting bitter or chalky. It's just really just rich. It's great with a glass of Pinot Noir or maybe um, some red, some dark reds. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Are you gonna jump right in there? I'm gonna. I'm, I'm gonna. I want <laughs> You're you to, trying to reach over me. I want to get, get over here butter. to this one because this is the peanut butter, right? It is. 
So milk chocolate, European inspired chocolate recipe. We then stuff it with our Virginia roasted peanuts. No salt, no sugar added, no stabilizers. It's just oh God. an explosion of peanut butter flavor on your palate. And then on the back end, you get that crunch Creamy. of the peanuts. Mm -hmm. And then Creamy the chocolate. So, right, exactly. Mm. So incredibly delicious. Three boxes. And what date, in fact, you know, let me just take a moment to show you how these come because it's so pretty. We did the amaryllis floral design on the outside of this box, perfect for the holiday season. When you open it up, it's like a fine box of chocolates. You get the parchment paper and then two trays are nestled inside each box. So what that means to you is maybe you want to give the peanut butter all together or maybe you want to give peanut butter and white chocolate or peanut butter and uh, peppermint or vice versa. You can do that with ever you want with each box. I love Ooh, that. Ooh, 3,000 sets are now gone. We are very, very busy. Thank lots you. and lots of you are excited about this. Shipping out on uh, November the 2nd or, I keep saying that. I, I know, saying I don't November know 2nd. why. So November the 4th. <laughs> All right, so that would be November the 4th or December the 2nd. So don't miss out on this opportunity because we are very, very busy. Lots and lots of you are loving this idea. There's not a pretzel in the bunch. No, this is all European inspired chocolate, not your kids' candy. This is the ultimate creamy cup collection from Landy's Candies. Butter caramel on the inside, um, peppermint ganache on the inside, peanut butter smooth and creamy on the inside. Just an explosion of flavor on your palate. And you're going to love also that these will last how long? Yeah, so up to a year, and you can freeze them actually. If you would like to freeze. Really? Because typically I wouldn't think we'd freeze chocolate. Nope, that's absolutely right. So if you, just like Alan Rosen's um, cheesecakes, if you wrap them in the plastic wrap first and then wrap pop the them whole in, box. Yep, wrap yeah. the whole box. Yep, absolutely. You can do that, but we just suggest that you bring that to room temperature before you enjoy them so that it just really melts on your tongue. It's just so beautiful. Well, I'm intrigued that you can freeze these because that just makes them. And how long will they last in the freezer? Yeah, so, so up to a year. I actually, you know, would say probably nine months, but we do have clearance for up to a year on these. And um, shelf uh, pantry stable six months. Yeah. Just, so, but keep them in a cool, dry place. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Ambient. Yeah. And these are not shipping until ambient. November. So by that That's time, right. it's going to be plenty, you know, cool outside. Although yesterday. Oh, my gosh. Was, was this like not gorgeous? Autumn. And it was 67 when we were I when we know. were driving when we were driving in today, David. It was just mm. absolutely just so beautiful, just a really lovely hit of chocolate, just a special treat for you for your loved ones. I love what Richard Linton says about these. He says that it's like a little fine liqueur that you would want to eat with, um, you know, a glass of wine. What are you doing? <laughs> Time to get all the caramel out. Oh my God, he's. And He's leave the chocolate intact. The chocolate. Oh my God. Okay, there's a first. Mm, <laughs> you yummy. Me up. Okay, yeah. It's just the butter caramel is Sweetie, caramel gravy. Yeah. Do I taste vanilla in this? Yes, absolutely. Our this is one of the notes of our uh, white chocolate. It ha does have a vanilla. Has vanilla swirled into it. It. No, the vanilla is not swirled. Is that a culinary term? I. <laughs> Darling. When they it's make the chocolate, <laughs> do they put the vanilla in with the chocolate? Yes, yes exactly. Yeah. It has a very nice butter note. In fact, do you want to show them how they make them? Don't venture too 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 much <laughs> off the highway, would you? <laughs> All right. Wait, I want to hear your culinary terms on the process flow, David, because it was so unique when we presented the spring collection. Uh huh. <laughs> they take a cup of chocolate. Here we go. Out of a mold. <laughs> no, we don't. And then there's a little opening or cavity inside. <laughs> and then they pipe it full of the peanut butter. Piping, that's a good word. And then they <laughs> slap a cap on it. <laughs> I knew and then they going. sprinkle some, some chopped peanuts up on it. Okay, we don't cap it off, but okay, whatever. And yes, we do. We top it off. So here you go. So we start with our um, shell that is finely crafted. And then we fill it, we stuff it, and then we top it. So you're getting that. And it's okay, just she a, fills it, she <laughs> stuffs it, she tops it. And I said cap, and that was somehow wrong. Uh -huh. Like a bottle cap? <laughs> no, like a cap you put on your hand. Oh, I see how it goes. All right, so let's show them by uh, how beautiful. Sorry, how about a lid on it? You put a lid on it. I know, that's what you usually say to me behind the scenes. Mimi, put a lid put on it. Put a lid it. on it. One time I told Mimi she should go to a website, www.zipit.com. I know. He Zip did. it. Oh my goodness. So look at how beautiful that peanut butter is. It is just about to flow right out of that peanut butter cup. Well, it's a generous it, amount too, it, isn't it? It is because these are just 
stuffed with that peanut butter, with that peppermint ganache, with that butter caramel. When I say an explosion of flavor on the inside of that bite, I literally do mean that. It is so incredibly delicious. Our spring collection was mm. off the hook. We brought so, back the I mean, peanut butter. What? Sorry. This one's really good. <laughs> This one is the peppermint. So, yes, and that is a peppermint ganache center. It's like a truffle, um, just a little bit. <laughs> oh, my God. I think I spilled some in my apron. <laughs> Silence. <laughs> if during They're Big Christmas so you see delicious. a great big piece of chocolate on my shirt, that's what happened. All right. So that's amazing, it's, honey. it's very bright because it's um, all-natural peppermint oil on the inside of our truffle ganache. And then we have the is crushed. That swirled in. <laughs> I, oh, I'm so happy that happened. Wait, look. Okay, so the lid, as you say, the, the lid came off. You can see how much center filling is inside each and every it's cup. loaded up. It is stuffed to the brim. So it is just so incredibly bright and beautiful. Dear Angel, yes? I know everyone thinks that I pick on you, and it's true, I do. It's true. I'm the entertainment behind but I, the scenes. You're the little sister I never had. <laughs> All right, so can I tell you... Yes. That now over 8,000 sets are gone. Oh my goodness, thank you all so much. Please use QVC.com and mobile apps. I mean, you guys have all had peanut butter cups of different varieties over the years, and I'm sure that's yeah. probably true. But something about this is so special because the quality of the chocolate is so lovely. Yeah. The fillings are really incredible. I mean, you bite into that white chocolate, it's like, again, like I said earlier with Harry London, it's like a waterfall yes. of caramel. And then this, this peppermint is not too pepperminty. You know, if you if you pick this up and all you taste it with peppermint, fire. Then then that would be bad, right? Right. So you want a nice, um, you want a, a top, bottom, and middle note that, in terms of all the flavors. Oh, now that sounds so professional, David. Exactly. Well, every now and again. <laughs> and then the peanut butter is just straight up delicious. I don't think I've ever had a peanut butter cup with chopped peanuts on top. No. In fact, when we were researching this product, we absolutely know for sure that at that time. There was no one doing a topped and filled and stuffed and just beautiful European chocolate um, in a cup. But yet, it is one of America's top candies, which is the, the yes, the, the cup. No, finish your thought. Oh, okay. The peanut butter cup is America's number two candy, believe it or not. What's number one? And, do you know the flavor profile is macaroni and cheese, and then peanut butter cup, and then cookies and cream. Yep. Oh. So we're working on a macaroni and cheese chocolate flavored cup for you. <laughs> huh? What? It's true. Those are the three top flavor profiles in America. Uh, in, yep. in candy. Oh, in candy, it's the peanut butter cup, peanut butter and chocolate, and it's cookies oh, and cream. Oh, oh. David, David, keep up. Well, I was, I thought I was right there with you, but then you confused me. Um, all right. Hey, Alan Rose is over there. Give him the, the, the bewildered dog stare like this. Alan. Look, I have been on your train for so long, dude. <laughs> she's looking for a little support here is what she's looking for. That's all right. right. Hey, can I tell you up. that we are completely lost my train of thought. Um, all right, so 9,000 of these are gone. You should know we're not shipping these until November the 4th or December the 2nd. So what, all you're doing today is reserving yours, and you'll be billed when these actually ship. Four easy payments on your credit card. One day only price will expire at end of day today or when the item sells out, whichever comes first. But given now that we are scaring the heck out of 10,000 gone, wow. I can't imagine Thank that this is going so to um, be around uh, until end of day. We just, I, this is what I'm going to say, it's uh, just after 2 p.m. East Coast time. If you're just tuning in, just got home from church and lunch, and you're tuning in, we're all food today on In the Kitchen with David. We're going to be with you for another uh, about 58 minutes. And then I have David's Big Christmas at 3 o'clock. I love that show. It's so much fun, It's going to be tons of fun today. We have a lot of new items today. Oh, wow. Well, that okay. we didn't see during Christmas in July. I'll have to do a drive-by. Well, you should because <laughs> it's very festive and it's very big. Yes, exactly. All right. So this is M65075. These are, are all so, delicious. so very exciting. Here's the story, are miniature. Glory. These are miniature like me. Mm. <laughs> Just what I was thinking. Um, we had over 15,000. Yes. In the November ship, I've got 2,000, and in oh December, 3,000. Oh, my goodness. We've sold 10,000 sets in the show. Thank you all so much for your support and your love. We and really this price it. will go away end of day today. Um, Ed, yeah. my producer, come here. You want white chocolate, dark Dive chocolate, or in, peanut butter? Ed. I'll go with the dark chocolate. With the, with the peppermint? Yes. Okay. And ask the ladies here which one they would like because you can bring them one. Ladies, which flavor would you like? 
peanut butter. And what about you, my dear? Off the hook. Which one? Peppermint. All right. See, an assortment for everybody, David. There butter, caramel, peppermint, peanut butter. There you go, Ed. Thank you. Take Ed, that to your you crew. thank you so much for keeping us cool. I had to look out for you, ladies. Ed will deliver. Okay, over 10,000 gone. I love you, Angel. Thank Here, let's so dance. Oh, let's okay. dance. Oh, okay. my gosh. I'd love to dance no, with you. I'm leading. Remember, oh, thanks. All right. Okay. <laughs> all right. Perfect. Perfect. <laughs> Bye, Angel. I'll Bye. see, you, I'll see I, you next time. Yes. All I'm, right. Um, straight home, no disco dancing. All right. Let's go over here and talk to Alan Rosen, who brought in some fantastic cakes and cheesecakes and layer cakes and all kinds of cake for the holidays. Hello, sir. Hello, David. How are you? Great. How are you, sir? Doing well, thank you. This is the Juniors 32 mini holiday mini cheesecakes and layer cakes in a sampler. We kicked this off over Christmas in July week. Correct. Or month, rather. Right. And over 19,000 sets have been ordered this season. Oh, my. Now, that, we're by shipping the way, this. That's my heart. <laughs> <laughs> I hope not, not completely or forever. Now, uh, we're going to ship immediately November the 4th or December the 2nd. So, we've already sold over 19,000 sets. You do these minis every year, is that Correct. right? Correct. But just, In some form. just for you. And this one is exclusive to QVC. You can't get this count anywhere else except right here on QVC. You get, not even at your bakery? Nope. 32 individual cakes. Each one is two and a half ounces. And here you go, David. So you're going to get eight of each one. Eight of the strawberry Christmas swirl. Yeah. Let me flip that around for you and grab a fork. But look, the same care and attention, David, that go into our large cakes cream cheese, fresh eggs, sugar, heavy cream, touch of vanilla, real strawberry puree. You have the green and red chips on, on top, so it looks like a, our big Christmas swirl, but you have an individual serving. You're going to get eight of these. I'm going to hand this off to the big yes, guy. Yes, please. You're holding the cherry I, well, from I before. I wanted to start with the Christmas you, because this is kind of the tradition. Correct. And this Christmas swirl cheesecake in varying sizes and forms has been around for good grief. 15, 15 17, 17 years. 15, 17 years. Right, we've been here since 1995, David. Mm, as we discovered you. Uh, in the 1550 tour. Correct, in 1995. And you were at Niagara Falls, New York, weren't you? I was. In the shadow of the big waterfall. Right. So next, we've never done mm, the great. plain cheesecake as one of these assortments, and people love our New York-style original cheesecake. Right. So that's the one, the same exact recipe we started with over 69 years ago. But what's great about the plain cheesecakes is if you want blueberry cheesecake today, you make a blueberry cheesecake. If you want cherry, you make cherry. Well, you want strawberry, cherry. right? I made that earlier. Made this early for me, so I waited I to taste it, it until we got to the to the uh, oh, plane. The same recipe, David, that we started with 69 years ago. It is the most creamy, the most delicious. Literally, cream cheese, fresh eggs, sugar, heavy cream, a touch of vanilla, and if you let it get to room temperature like we have here, that's how it should be, folks. I spilt it over, but look at that. Sticks to the fork. It's the it's the most famous cheesecake in mm. the world. Mm. You all won awards for this year after year after year, haven't you? Absolutely. Man, is that good. This is what's kept us in business, David. Just the plain. Yeah, well, without that basic recipe that is the followed wouldn't through, exist. they wouldn't exist. Now, it, your restaurant opened on Election Day 1950. Correct. Opened by your, was Grand, it, your, my your grandfather. My grandfather. Yeah. I'm the third generation. Next up, David, you're going to get eight of the double chocolate cheesecakes. Well, why do we call it double chocolate? Because not only is there obviously chocolate in it, but there's white chocolate swirled in there. So you have white chocolate cheesecake and chocolate cheesecake. And again, if you like a candy bar, if you like cheesecake, if you like creamy desserts, mm. this is all portion controlled. You could entertain the whole, if you got this for Thanksgiving, you could use this for Thanksgiving and Christmas. Well, All I ask is if you open up the package, right. you wrap the whole thing in plastic. Well, I think I've told you before, uh, my mom has her, her famous Christmas party every year, and she serves these just about every single year. And she loves them because the folks that come to the party don't want a lot of any one dessert. They want lots of different desserts. Correct. And these are portion controlled, so ranging in mm. from 200 calories to so 240. Good. Can you imagine you could eat that whole cake, David, and that is 230 calories? That's amazing. Isn't that and great? And I love how you took the cheesecake and swirled it into the chocolate. Yeah. Nice. Next, you're going to get... An apple cinnamon layer cake. It's got a blend of buttercream and cream cheese frosting. It's got fresh chopped up apples into the mix. I'm going to turn around in one second. You can actually see the apples inside the cake. 
okay? We have to make them small because the cakes are small. And then most miniature desserts, David, you know, the stuff gets dry, it's not so creamy. Look at that. As creamy as in our large cakes, mm. same exact recipes, just in an individual portion control. So you're gonna get it. eight of those. And I quickly wanna show people as you taste that, of course. how it comes packaged. All right. Mm. Alan, it's just perfect. So, so Thank good. Thank you. So imagine having those mixed with some cheesecakes for your Thanksgiving holiday table. Oh, it'd be so great. So this is how they're gonna come. Eight of the plain, eight of the strawberry, eight of the double chocolate, and eight of the cinnamon apple layer cakes. Take out what you want straight from frozen. Mm -hmm. The reason we started making these individuals for QVC is because people didn't want any waste. Sometimes they don't need all 32 servings. True story. Okay, or 20 or 10. So you waste a half a cake or a quarter of a cake. Pop them out from frozen. Let them sit out at room temperature for as many hours as you like. They'll be as creamy and smooth as what you see right here. I love it. Keep the rest in the freezer for up to six months. Over 500 of these are now gone. And remember, everyone can choose their ship week. Either have these delivered now, 11 4 or 12 2. Now, if we put these in the freezer, they'll be good for six months. Yeah, right? so you could get them now. Use the plain cheesecakes for your uh, Labor Day holiday. Let me tell you also. We have auto delivery on this. That's true. So your first shipment will be holiday, and then your next shipment will be in time for Easter. And your Easter cakes, or uh, your assortment rather, is here. This is the Easter assortment. So your strawberry swirl, we do away on this side, guys. On this side. There we go. So your uh, your uh, strawberry swirl gives way to pastel colored chips. Correct. Same chocolate, same plain, and carrot cake. Love it. Then the one on the other side is for summer. That's your third shipment. And you're going to get lemon, plain, chocolate, and raspberry swirl. Correct. Yeah. All right. Well done. And Thank the lemon, you. tell me more about the lemon. The it's lemon a is... lemon coconut layer cake, like what you love. Oh, okay. So, is that lemon curd in there? Yes, of course. Yeah, nice. And fresh coconut on top. Mm. But again, the strawberry swirl is the most popular cake on QVC, David, every year. But this time, you get two and a half ounces, by the way, which is more than enough dessert for all of yeah, us. Yeah, eat the whole dessert and not feel guilty about it. Right. I mean, it's got the same calories as my protein bar I had on the way down here today. How about that? Okay, but again, the same strawberry puree throughout, not just swirled on top, because there's nothing worse, David, than having a dessert and not having all the ingredients you love in every bite. Exactly. Now, these are four easy payments on your credit card of just $17.35. We've got a lot more coming up in the last 50 minutes of our program. We still have a lobster around the corner. I've got real German gingerbread up next. Nice. Imported from Germany. Unbelievable. We also have lint truffles, I think, around the corner. And a whole lot more. Nice Mr. Rosen, always a pleasure. Nice to see Good you. Good to David. see you, Thank pal. Thank you. All right. Speaking of German gingerbread, let's make our way over here. This is German gingerbread, and it's dunked in Belgian chocolate. How lovely is that? This comes to us from a, camp, a company called Lambert's in Western Germany. This company and this recipe have been around for 330 years? Yes. Oh, my word. And we have the pastry chef who is in charge of new product development at Lambert's. His name is Hubert Vogel. And Chef, it's a pleasure to have you here. How many years have you been with this German company? More than 30. More than 30 yes. years. So they only have you beat by about 300 years, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, they have. Chef, it's a great pleasure Thank to have you, you here. Thank, Thank you, you for joining us. It's a great pleasure us. to be here and to show our beautiful products from Germany. Tell us more about Lambert's. Lambert's is a company. It's 330 years old. It's doing ginger, but it's the world leader in doing Christmas cookies. And we did this year exclusive for QVC in the U.S. this beautiful Christmas. Christmas market boxes. Oh. We call it in German Weihnachtsmarkt Dose. It's a box and it's a scene of the German Aachen Christmas market original. Okay. And we have more than one million people every year. I'll hold coming. this for you and you describe it. Okay. It, this is the scene. This is the capital of Aachen and in front is the Christmas market and there comes more than one million people every year. So, and this box we sell there and now it's the first time for the US that we sell it exclusive here. And the same artwork on the sides here. The side. And then when you open this up, there are, I believe we decided there are 76 pieces. 76 pieces. Individually in four, wrapped in trays. In trays, in four trays. 
So, which makes it very good for a long shelf life, it stays until March 2020. So, and if you don't open this cellophane package, that will stay fresh until March of 2020? Yes, it is. Wow. Yep. Okay, let's go through what's in, included yes. here. Because, as you say, there are 76 pieces. However, there are how many varieties? We have six varieties. Six and varieties. Yes, we call them, this is the three layer gingerbread, Domino Steine, it's gingerbread, it's jelly, and it's a marzipan. Then we have a diamond shape with fruit pieces. Okay, in right here's the diamond. The diamond shape with fruit pieces in. Uh, well, yeah, there it, it is. There it is. So, and then we have our traditional over there, printing. All the way here. All the way here. It's the the, the printing with with brown sugar and milk chocolate. So that's just the gingerbread dunked in chocolate. Dunked in chocolate. We have the milk in dark, and we have dark chocolate. And I want to show you how soft they are. But so what's that on top, chef? There's a roasted nuts. Roasted Ro nuts. Roasted nuts. And, and then robed in the chocolate. And robed in chocolate. And then you oh. can see how soft. And you see the pieces of the nuts on top, and it's yes. very soft. So, and it's a bit of it, the, the taste is a little bit of cinnamon, the nutmeg. It's not too strong. The, the I'm going to dig right in. Just let me say real quickly, and then I'm going to start eating. Um, November 4th, December 2nd are your ship weeks. No auto delivery on this. Four easy payments. And since we kicked this off earlier this season, over 9,000 already pre ordered. You will not be billed until this actually ships. Chef, I'm going to sneak across you here and Please. grab one of these with the nuts. Yes. It's and begin here. So this is your signature gingerbread. Yes, it's a signature gingerbread. And then covered with roasted nuts, and then enrobed in. Is this no, dark chocolate? First, yes, it's dark chocolate. First we cover it with chocolate. Then we bring the roasted nuts, and then we cover it again. More with chocolate. More chocolate. So, oh. so and the roasted nuts, the chocolate, the cinnamon, and so all the soft. And then the nuts are so crunchy. Yep. This is what gingerbread is supposed to taste like. Oh, chef, it's amazing. Yes, thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Mm. But you have to realize that when you've got a recipe that's 330 years old, you don't fix what's not broken. No. Oh, my word. This is crazy delicious. Oh, my word. So, and mm. the good thing is, you know, this is so mm. traditional for the German Christmas markets. Mm. So, and now we bring you the Christmas to, to the U.S. place, and you bring it just direct to the house. And then just regular gingerbread. The regular gingerbread, chocolate. chocolate and chocolate, spice with honey, the dark ones. Milk chocolate. We have again here the diamond shape. This is a little bit more fruit pieces in. A uh, precut. Oh, is there fruit in there? It's fruit in there. Let me have a little taste of that. So, and the taste is a bit stronger. The spices are a little bit more, not mm, much. But I like it. Yeah, it's different. You know. Really good with coffee. Yeah, a wonderful oh. coffee or a glass of red wine. Believe me, it's oh, yes. red wine and the dark chocolate. And, and the spices that makes a very good mixture. So it's, and the, the, the pieces are small, so it's not too much, it's just one bite. And then this has the marzipan. This has the marzipan, the jelly. Hmm? Oh, I really like yeah, that. Yeah, 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 it's nice. It's so Oh, my yeah, word, is that yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. This is the real deal. This is real gingerbread, German gingerbread. Yeah. And over, how many have gone on this show? 1,300 now gone on this show. The 10 that you're going to receive, first of all, has the Christmas market depicted. These tins become collectible, and this is a new tin this year. Is it's that a right? new tin. It's exclusive done for the U.S. QBC. Yes. All right. Now, when you open the tin, there are four trays inside. Thank you, Chef. If you'll hold that. Four tins, or excuse me, four trays rather, four. of all the varieties that we just showed you. If you leave these in their wrapper, and if you don't open them, they're good until March of 2020. Yes, 2020 easily. Yeah. And then our last one. So. And then, when all the gingerbread is gone, you keep the tin and use it as a decoration, right? Yes. And then use it for gifts, use it for decorations around your home, put them under the Christmas tree. That's a real German village, Christmas village. It exists. And this is a piece, you know, you can put it somewhere in the shelf. But it looks nice, you know, it's a nice decoration even for the holidays. Mm. So, and it's a beautiful present. And if you're not sure you'll remember what's what, there is a photo guide on the bottom of the box. So, folks, if you're giving this as a gift, you'll know exactly what it is. They'll know exactly what they're eating. They'll just follow the little uh, photo guide on the bottom of the box. This is lovely. And again, this is a tin, so it's a very strong and durable box and really, really perfect for this. We are very, very busy now. 2,000 sets are gone. You know, there's gingerbread and then there's German gingerbread. Coming to us from a company that has been around for 330 
years. Yep. You must have an amazing museum at Lambert's. Yeah, we have. With photos and yes, all the different we, people. So and all the different, and you know, we are wow. very proud of this. We, we, we bring the, the, the cookies all over the world, and now it's the first time that we bring it with QVC to the U.S. market. We come last year with the first gingerbread, now with this box, and we're happy that we can bring it to here. Does Father Christmas sometimes leave these in stockings? Yes, that is. For the German children? Yeah. Now, do German children put up stockings? Yeah, we do stockings. You do yes. stockings Yes, as well. of course, okay. yeah. yeah. And this is just so exciting because, oh my word, something so special, something so perfect. And maybe Father Christmas leaves these for all the good little German boys and girls. Now, all the American boys and girls yeah. of all ages, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. 2,500 of these are now gone. Chef, what a pleasure to have Thank you, you here. Thank, Thank you. you Thank friend. you to be here. All right. Now, as we make our way over, we have what coming up? Oh, we have Beatrice's fruitcake. 20,000 ordered this season. And I'm going to tell you, the last time we had this on the air, it sold out. And the first time I tasted this, I was not sold that I was going to like fruitcake. Because I was not really convinced that they ever made new fruitcake. I thought people just kept regifting them. Yeah. And so, because the ones that I'd had before were not good, these are amazing. It has like three different kinds of liqueur in it. Uh -huh. That is all the buzz backstage is everyone is talking about that Buzz cake. would be the proper term. Buzz. <laughs> That's what you did there, Buzz. 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 Actually, you know, the alcohol cooks off as it bakes, but it's, it it's a great flavor. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Mm -hmm. Jennifer Kovich is here, one of our foodies, Hi. and we're thrilled to have you back with so us. Good to be nice here. to good see to you, see Angel. You too, Appreciate honey. you. This is Greenhead Lobster, mm -hmm. and we're talking about the largest lobster tails that Greenhead brings to QVC. Yes. yes. And they only do these a couple times a year because, quite honestly, these are bigger lobsters That's right. and harder to catch. They are much harder to find. And you know, the most important part here is not only are you getting six to seven ounces, six to seven ounce size, which is really hard pressed to find, even of those five star dining experiences that maybe you've had. But look at this. That is what this is all about. It's no more about how much you buy, it's about how much you get to enjoy. In this case, you get to enjoy every single bit. Look inside that shell, there's literally nothing left. I was able to pull every bit of that lobster meat out with ease based on one thing. What we put this through is a preparation method that we affectionately call HPP. We only do this for the QVC customer here at Greenhead Lobster. And what we love is that it's only water that's transmitted right through the shell at such a high rate of pressure and speed that allows for 100% separation of the meat from the shell. Well, it's extraordinary. And what you're going to be choosing today is six or 12 of these. If you go with that 12 piece count, you're going to save $28 with our stock up and save. You're also going to choose when you want these delivered, either November the 4th or December the 2nd. That's when these will ship out. Mm -hmm. You should also be aware that there's an auto delivery opportunity here every four months for a year. Now, if you order six tails, you'll get one tub of Kate's. 100% pure made in Maine butter. That's right. If you order 12 tails, you'll get two tubs of the butter. Mm -hmm. And this is what we've melted down to dunk. That's right. All this delicious sweet lobster meat in. We have a little video, I believe, of we where do. these come from. And you should know that this is all certified Maine lobster. It is caught in some of the coldest, deepest waters off the coast of Maine. That's right. And we all know that when you go to that five star restaurant, what you see on the menu, you see cold water Maine lobster tail because it's the most sweet, succulent lobster tail that you can get in the world. It's incredible. You are getting true certified lobster delivered right to your door, assuring that you are getting that fresh dock to door experience. Why is that important and what makes it certified? We only work with certified lobstermen that have been certified by the state of Maine. We too have our own certificate to receive all of these lobster tails. We know that they are only harvested within the deep cold waters of Maine because it is right off the coast of Maine. That is what makes it certified, fully traceable. We know who caught the lobster tail, where, and when. But again, it's also all about that HPP method that we only do for you, the QVC customer. This is why we know that you love Greenhead Lobster because even down to the littlest tiny tip of that tail, you get to enjoy. No more mallets, no more crackers, no more shears, nothing fancy tools to pass around. Just wonderful, snowy white, perfectly sweet, succulent goodness. And you're also going to appreciate the fact that this is the kind of situation where 
There's no cracking the shell, hitting it yes. with a mallet, getting out a jackhammer to get in there That's and get right. all that <laughs> lobster tail meat out. Um, you're going to have this delivered either November or December. I want you to think about right. special occasion for holiday, yes. Christmas Eve dinner, New Year's Eve, New Year's Day, mm -hmm. surf and turf. If you're yeah. buying some of Ray Westelli's beautiful uh, fillets, wouldn't it be lovely to do the beef wellingtons and the lobster? Oh, oh my gosh, that would be perfect. And then little Bang. tiny um, little bowls at each little place setting with little clarified butter. Uh -huh. Pass uh -huh. that around, uh -huh. it would be outstanding. Well, everyone should have their own bowl for dunking. Oh, absolutely. That way you don't have to double dip. Yeah. Um, absolutely. All right, well, you can double dip in your own bowl. That's right. <laughs> uh, hey, let's also remind you that this is certified Maine lobster. This is something very, very special. You should also be aware that it is five easy payments on the credit card. Hey, out of car. Ready for some lobster, darling? <laughs> yeah, Alec Carr's like, mm -hmm. yeah, she's Now, have ready. your kids Just ever had lobster? Job. They haven't had lobster, but my kiddos do like seafood because I tell them it's mermaid food. See? Oh, and then they're nice. like, they think it's like magical. That's well, they awesome. think salmon That's is awesome. mermaid food, right? Yeah, salmon, scallop, shrimp. Mermaid food. It's all mermaid food. It's all mermaid food. All right. Yeah, but this would be so decadent, you know, and talk about like making a, a holiday very, very special. Very special. And yeah. memorable without you having to put a lot of effort mm -hmm. forward. Well, That's this right. is something great, and and the lot of not of uh, what did you say, <laughs> not a lot of effort huh? is exactly right. Were well, you eating the pound cake? I, I was yeah, eating right. something. I was eating the beef <laughs> fruitcake. Fruit cake. <laughs> uh, this is what's really incredible because now everything is here, including That's cooking methods. Is that right, my darling? Cooking yes. methods. Yes, cooking methods could not be simpler. You can bake these, but we like to boil these because it could not be simpler. You just put them in a nice pot of boiling water. Rule of thumb is one minute per ounce. So in this case, I would do seven to eight uh, minutes and then you're ready to go. That's they are quick. fantastic. It's so, so simple. And it really is all about, like you said, making the memories. Well, let's mm -hmm. be honest, we tend to spend a little bit more time and effort and money around the holidays to make those memories, to make it extra special. This is a perfect opportunity to give six mm -hmm. to seven ounces of just wonderful certified Maine lobster. Mm. It's That's just so perfect. Tender. The six-piece count is going quickly. Lots of you are making that choice tonight. Did you get, did you get some butter? No. Sure. Well, then you have to have another All right. bite. Well, it was good without the butter, too. Well, imagine what it's going to be like with the butter. That's my right. sho my shoes right. would taste good with and butter. And butter comes with it, right, Jennifer? It does. It's from Arendelle, Maine, so this is all mm -hmm. about those Maine traditions. A little sea salt butter, in me. there. Yeah. Yeah, right. yeah you so you'll get it on your shirt. That's right. How's that working out? Yeah, that's pretty good. Sweet oh, clarified it? butter. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's incredible. Delightful. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. My it's girl, Alec Carr, she worked it out. Oh, hey, join us on the Facebook chat, too. We'd love to hear from you. We're having a lot of fun. Exactly. David Venable QVC is where we're chatting, <laughs> and Miss Ali is, is uh, conducting yeah. the chat as Stacy is away mm -hmm. on vacation. I'll head back over there. Uh, but aren't you up next with Truffles? Oh, yep. Mm -hmm. You are, <laughs> yeah. so I'm going to ask you to go that well, I'm way. I'll grab my card. Well, get your card and then come back this way <laughs> okay. because we've got about a minute left here and I will tell you this is extraordinary. Also, if you go into a restaurant and you sit down and you decide you're going to order lobster and you run your finger down to where lobster is on the menu and you run across to the price and it says market price, I want you to fake an illness leave the restaurant. They're about to take all your money. Mm -hmm. Because when they put market price on the menu, they're going to charge you whatever it costs them to get the lobster, mm -hmm. and then whatever their markup is on top of that. Right. And if it's holiday season, that markup is probably going to be even bigger. It will be even bigger because they know that they can. Everyone is willing to spend a little bit more around the holidays to have that luxurious meal, to really make those memories extra special. We happened to be in Florida a couple weeks ago visiting some dear friends of ours, and what we did was we ordered some of our greenhead lobster tails. We couldn't get the six to seven ounce size. We had to get the five to six ounce size. Yeah. We had them shipped directly to their door, so it was a little gift for them. But what we loved most is what by the time that we got there, it arrived, and I was able to cook it for them. They actually sent me a card. I got it in the mail yesterday. Oma, Opa, if you're, if you're watching, thank you so much. But they sent a thank you card for us just because of that one meal that we made for them that made it so incredibly special. That's why we love Greenhead. That's why we love things like lobster. And if you don't know where the lobster is sourced when you go in one of those expensive restaurants, what do we always say about lobster? Know your source. That's right. And this comes right from Maine. It's certified Maine lobster. You mm -hmm. want the best barbecue in the country? You go to Memphis. That's right. You want the best lobster? You go to Maine. That's right. But you only want certified Maine lobster. Yes. This is M64045. So we're going to get you all squared away. Jennifer, thank, thank you. Thank you. Good to see you. So, Miss Allie Carr, we're going to take a short break. And when we come back, you're going to spell me. Give me a little chance to, um, you know, visit the little host room. Okay. Thank you for that. <laughs> and, uh, and, but you know what's coming up? We're going to be here until 3 p.m. with more food. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. And then I'm here at 3 o'clock. Say it with me. David's Great Big Christmas. Here's more information about that. You did really well. It was good. Join David Venable as he shares some of his holiday favorites during David's Great Big Christmas. Be there Sunday at 3 p.m. Eastern on QVC. Dr. Lancer, dermatologist to the stars, has been helping his clients maintain radiant-looking skin for more than 30 years. Once available only to his celebrity patients, now you too can experience the star treatment. Join Candace Cameron Bure to discover new products from Lancer Skincare, Tuesday at 8 p.m. on QVC. Treat yourself to a new handbag this fall, like this Nylon Hobo bag from Dooney & Burke. Find your favorite Monday at midnight Eastern on QVC. Hot Hippie Tribe, Tuesday at 9 p.m. Eastern on QVC. You're watching QVC. Okay, well, as we continue with our three-hour food show, we have to have all about Lux Decadent Chocolate. When I worked in one of the most iconic jewelry stores in the U.S., what was what the one treat that we would serve our high-end clients so they would come in to look at specialty pieces? It was lint. This is an amazing assortment. It's Lint Lindor. This is a 50-piece holiday truffle set. And of course, joining me, the one and only, a master chocolatier trained <laughs> in Switzerland. This is Anne. Okay, we are so happy that you are joining us. I'm so excited to be here, Allie. With some of the absolute best chocolates. Um, and this is an exclusive configuration that you can't find anywhere else because you won't find this kind of mix-up of the 50 pieces that you're getting for a sale price of $25.68. You have the opportunity to have this shipped out November 4th or December 2nd. You won't be charged until these ship. But look how decadent of a presentation. Let's talk a little bit about the background on Lint and what makes these truffles so special. Well, Allie, Lint has been making chocolate since premium chocolate, yeah. since 1845. So if you think, wow, that kind of longevity, mm -hmm. it really says it all, that, that Lint really knows what we're doing. We make our chocolate from the cocoa bean all the way to the finished product. What flavors do we get in this 50 count? Oh, these are the best flavors. Okay. So we have our iconic milk chocolate, um, Lindor truffle. So I think maybe you should have one. Oh, okay. I'm I not will, gonna... I will twist arms. Right, please. I will. So here you go. Okay, so this is the milk chocolate. This is the milk chocolate. So it's this hard chocolate shell. And when you bite in, you get this smooth mm. melting you see center. That? Mm. So good. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. You see what I'm talking what about there? It's multisensorial. Mm -hmm. It's delicious. It's like nothing you've ever experienced. And the flavor is so rich but smooth. <sighs> it's delicious. Okay, so that's okay. your classic milk chocolate. Classic milk chocolate. Then we have dark chocolate. So that's Ooh. the dark chocolate Sack. shell with the dark mm -hmm. chocolate center. We have the caramel truffle. Oh, yum. Milk and milk. And then... This is something fun. This is our seasonal snowman truffle. Okay. So watch this. So 200 of these already spoken for at the oh. sale price of 25.68. So when you cut this, you have a surprise. So it's white oh, in the center. Like and a snowman. Exactly. Hence the snowman. the snowman. And look at the creaminess of the, the center. Oh, yeah. That's that smooth melting mm -hmm. Lindor center. There's something, you know, this is such a perfect treat. You know, sometimes when you just want something a little bit sweet, yeah. it's after a long day, maybe you're having a cup of tea or hot cocoa or milk or wine, or even in the oh, afternoon when you have that cup of coffee, this is the perfect accompaniment and it feels so special, right? It feels like a moment with Lint Lindor. What's yes. lovely about this is it could be a sensational gift. I would even urge you to. So when I worked at the jewelry store, whenever my kids would come in to visit, mm -hmm. one of the store managers, a sweet Earl, would always sneak my kids oh. Lint Lindor truffles. So now, of course, what kind of truffles do they Of course, like? it's, it's Only all lint. they want is lint because they have great taste that you've started developing yeah. when, since they were little tiny things. This one, this is new. Okay. This is, this is pretty new. Um, this is the butter pecan Ooh. truffle. So it's milk chocolate with pecans in the shell and a milk oh. center. So just a little bit so of the pecans good. in the shell, yes. but mm -hmm. then you still have that creamy yes. interior. Do you want to cut one of those open? I would so love to see? cut one. And I'm, I'm pretty proud of this because I developed it. Ooh. Yes. I have so to earn this hat. training goes into be a, <laughs> a chocolatier? chocolatier? I actually had the privilege of studying in Switzerland. I did an apprenticeship 
when I was a little bit older than your average student. You have Yum. to try one of those. Okay. So you're never too old to follow your passion. Okay. And, and then you've got that creamy yes. interior. Yes. Mine's going to have teeth marks pretty soon. Yes, take it, eat that? it, eat it, yes. So just, you know, I went to school, I studied, I learned from the mm. best because Swiss chocolate, we know Switzerland has fantastic chocolate. And well, you can see, they did a good job training. That they butter really pecan did. flavor, it's so subtle. And it's not like all crunchy. You get just a little just bit a in the tiny shell. Just a tiny little bit. And otherwise, it's smooth, it's rich, and it's decadent. This is where I love because you're able to just take a truffle. And it is so beautiful and so special that even if you're just having one, it feels like whatever you're doing in that day, it kind of creates that moment and that it special is. treat for yourself. Yeah. Now, I'm not saying you have to limit yourself to one. I probably have, two. I probably, probably have two. more than two. But for $25.68, think about an amazing gift. You bring this to the office. Yep. You know, you bring this to share with friends and family, mm -hmm. or even you have unexpected visitors stop by. You're like, ooh, we're kind of in between meals. I want to put out something sweet. What, what do I put? Just a little bowl, fill it with your lint Lindor, and it is instantly right. impressive. You cannot get this assortment anywhere else. So, Anne, walk me through, because we've got yes. the caramel. So we have the caramel, the, the holiday truffle, the snowman. Yeah. The, look at that. The milk with the white okay. center, the milk truffle, the butter pecan, and the dark. So, so for almost 2,000 have been spoken for. So here's what you decide. Do you want to get this shipped out the week of November 4th or December 2nd? You're not going to be charged until this ships, but this is all exclusive. You're not going to find this as assortment anywhere else. I love almost kind of mixing like one of each. Mm -hmm. Right, these are great if you're gonna help Santa fill the stocking because they are Absolutely. so decadent. Or maybe just that one little treat for you. So I just need something a little that, sweet. That little me time. Yeah. Because you're so stressed at the holidays. Mm -hmm. Take your okay, caramel. Well, how do you eat your chocolate? With like wine, coffee, tea, yes. with chocolate? Yes, all <laughs> of the above. Everything. All of the above, mm -hmm. depending on my them. mood. <laughs> well, it depends on the time of the day. Exactly. Wine in the evening because wine in the morning people will talk. Yeah, that's they will talk. Yeah, yeah, that's a little questionable, <laughs> <laughs> but definitely in the evening. <laughs> but with lint, you know what the quality is there, and this is all beautiful Swiss chocolate. So you're going to enjoy not only something that's elevated, that's decadent, but that you can only get here at QVC for twenty-five dollars and sixty-eight cents. To get that fifty is such a great opportunity. I mean, when we used to have those high-end clients come in, this is what they would look for. Can we see one of the dark chocolates? Yes, absolutely. Here, you'll cut one. I'm going to Okay. I'm going to indulge eat. a little bit. And you should indulge because life is short, mm. right? <laughs> and just enjoy all the good How things. Delicious. All the good chocolate, the wine. Yeah, I, the, do the dark chocolate with a glass of wine. So good. A red wine, Oh, yes. Say? Red wine, for mm. example. Look at that. So it's perfect. It's that dark, indulgent treat. It's not treat. too bitter. No, no, it's so not. It's perfectly balanced. It's perfectly, because it's all about the chocolate. We want mm -hmm. you to have the best possible chocolate experience. Mm -hmm. Premium chocolate. Over 3,000 have already been spoken for. $25.68, all you have to decide. Do you want it shipped out November 4th or December 2nd? Just pick one of the dates. You've got to get this. And thanks so much for joining us. Thank you, Allie. It was my pleasure. I mean, anybody that brings me chocolate is like a bestie. Okay. So you're, bestie. you're in the club. Cool. Hey, David, though, if you're looking for the perfect beverage to maybe pair with your lint chocolate, how about a great cup of coffee? Welcome back, everyone. It's time for us to talk about delicious and delightful coffee. I wish you could smell in here because it smells like a coffee shop. We're talking about Harry and David Moose Munch, and you're like, well, where's the popcorn? Uh, this is actually Harry and David Moose Munch ground coffee assortment. Mm, Dana Fleming is here from Harry hi, and David. David. Pouring I've up got, a delightful cup of coffee. I've that got smells a great. nice perk for you this Ooh. afternoon. And four different, <laughs> a little, little pick-me-up this afternoon. Four wow. different flavors for That's us to right. enjoy here, and you get four 12 ounce containers of ground coffee. Is that right? That's correct. It's now, all ground. And you get all of them. There are four different flavors. You want to walk us through the flavors? I would love to. So you're going to get 12 ounces of caramel. That's um, our signature caramel recipe infused in coffee. It is delicious. It smells so good in here, you guys. You're going to get the milk chocolate caramel. That's that customer favorite flavor. You're going to get the peanut butter and 
chocolate. And David, I thought of you on this one right mm. away. I know how you love that peanut I butter. I do love peanut butter and chocolate. And you're also going to get the s'mores, and that's a family favorite. I love thinking of that one as a dessert and maybe serving it during the holidays, make your house smell magical. Well, these smell amazing. And I think what you're going to love about this is that you're giving all the great mm. flavor profiles that we have always loved so much in Moose Munch, and now you're enjoying it in some really delicious ground coffee. But this is also going to be something that is subtle. I don't want you to feel like you're going to take this and it's oh. going to overwhelm. Yes, in terms I, of the it, it's very well balanced. So it is not overpowering. It has a very nice flavor profile, very smooth. I'm a cream girl. I know we all like our coffee different. I love a little cream in there and maybe throw a little bit of sugar. Oh, I'm worried. And, with you oh my gosh. Now, which one am I drinking? Is this the peanut butter chocolate? That is the milk. That is the milk chocolate caramel. Milk actually, chocolate caramel. that just came right out of the pot mm. over here. Um, and what I love doing with that one too, I like making these de mm. even desserty. They're great on their own. But really nice. And I think, uh, you know, I don't usually uh, drink my coffee black, but I wanted to try these black because I think you're going to get the real true understanding of the flavor. Yes. And that's really delightful. Um, now, if you're using your K cup, yes. Your um, your what do they call this? My K cup filter. That's right. If you use the My K cup filter, then you're going to be able to use this and scoop it right into that My K cup filter, and then right. pop it right into your Keurig. Right, and That's this is the how you do it. That's the beauty of an item like this one. Yes, and you put it right in there. You drop it down. You hit your button. All you got to know is what size you want, what size brew, and we're going to do two, which I think is eight ounces, and I'm going to start. So you've got yourself a nice, delicious, warm yes. cup of coffee. There we go. And voila. I have the same it, machine at home. Oh, you do? <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Um, and it's going to smell amazing. Okay, so let me go through all four flavors with you again and tell you we're shipping this either now, 11 4 or 12 2. The immediate ship is flying, you guys. Oh. If you want to hit mine with a little bit of that whipped oh, topping, I'd love I wouldn't to. be upset about that at all. Oh, you got um, it. All right, so milk chocolate caramel, which is the one that I'm drinking now. Yes. Classic caramel. Mm hmm. Then I've got peanut butter chocolate. Uh huh. Which one of these I is can smell it. Chocolate? This is the peanut that butter one? chocolate. I'd love for you to try that I would. one. And then we've got the s'mores. And this one is peanut butter chocolate? Uh, this one's peanut butter and chocolate, yes. Let me smell it first. You get that nice. Mm, yeah, you I really totally get that it. peanut smell in there, right? Oh, that's nice. It's thick. Well, what we do, we, they're grown and hand harvested in small estates mm. around the world. Now, you and, know what I would do with this? What? They sell a chocolate peanut butter cup creamer. Oh. Yeah, they do. Ooh. Yeah, and it's by the same famous peanut butter, chocolate peanut butter cup brand that we know. Yeah. Love it. In fact, there's one broken on the label. <laughs> you can see it on the label. Um, I would pour that in this and just have a party for breakfast. Heaven. This is one that's going to wake you up. This is this one that's going to so get good. you out of bed in the morning. Now, these are all caffeinated. None of these are decaf. These are caffeinated. Um, you know what? And, and guys, I do want to point out there's 17 servings in each bag. I mean, I just want to say, think of how much money you could be spending at the coffee shop. In here, you can make your own delicious brews at home mm. and start your mornings off beautifully. And it doesn't even have to be for morning. I mean, I would have these in the afternoon. Well, I mean, we dessert. all have a hankering for a cup of coffee at different times of day. Yeah, right? that's right. And right now is a great time, actually. And maybe send it. Yeah, I know. I'm about this time of day when you, it'll pick me up. Send these coffees as a gift for coffee lovers on your gift list, particularly yes. for folks that are hard to buy for. Yeah. I think something like this would be great. We're making a little s'more coffee I'm now. making a s'more coffee, putting those um, marshmallows in there, a little graham cracker. This one has the delicious notes of the graham and um, the caramel, but then you also get the sweetness from the marshmallow. And again, it's all roasted in. We do the roasting in the Pacific Northwest where we're known for making good roasted coffees. And um, so what you do is you start with that base and then you can add to it how you like. If you like your coffee black, that's great. But if you want to add something to it, you can do that too. And you can make it in your Keurig. You can even do a French press like we have here, which is wonderful. It makes the most amazing oh, the French coffee. French press is wildly Love it. delicious. And then we also have it in the drip coffee maker. So if you're hosting a large group, um, you can make it in a big brew.
So you know what I tell you, uh, in, uh, for me in the morning there is nothing nicer than getting up and getting a nice big old cup of coffee and snuggling up on the sofa mm. and just wrapping your hands around that mug, particularly as we get into the change of seasons. Mm -hmm. And if you love all the great flavors of Harry and David Moose Munch, now you've got those great flavors in coffee. That's this right. This is brand spanking new today. We're excited to have it for you uh. and stay on the line. We'll get you all squared away, Dana. <laughs> a awesome. pleasure to have you back. Oh, love nice being to see here. You. Love seeing you, David. All right, we're gonna head out over this. Way and is it time for fruitcake? Oh, we have to do our. Oh, we're tasting the recipe first. Right. Here we go. Adina, 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 Adina uh, Michio. You know, I smelt this delicious veggie burger and I had to partake. Now, I want, before we bite into this, I hope that we can shoot this yes. one tight. Because I want you to see that what do you see inside that burger? Oh. Real vegetables. You see carrots, you see scallions, you see all the kinds of things. We use black beans to help bind this, some oats to help bind it. We also uh, mix in shredded carrots and scallions, oh. a little Worcestershire sauce for extra flavor. What's this here? What's that? No, Worcestershire, it's my joke. You don't <laughs> never heard of the what's this, what's this here? Oh, what's this here? Oh, come on. Worcestershire. It's like, that's my okay. shameless kitchen joke. Lynn, I know. I know, I know, I know, one. I know. Yeah. It's the joke you had though, and I appreciate the timing. Yeah, yeah I do. <laughs> All right, ladies. We dive in. Have a bite, because I want you okay. to tell me what you think. First texture. Mm. How's the texture? Like a burger. Yeah? Nice and like sticky. Yeah. Mm. You know, like sure, sure, sure. It's mm. bound. And then you've got? Fresh flavor. Mm-hmm. Do you taste the Worcestershire? What's this here? What's this here? Look, can I go for bite number two? It's so good. It's and then good. there's black beans in there, there's mm. scallions in there, carrots. My, my nieces and nephews, my sister, salt and pepper. They're vegan. Mm. They right. love this. You know what you could also and put in there is a little too. cumin if you wanted to. Mm. I think cumin is really oh. nice in a veggie burger. Burger blowout. Uh, yeah. Did you have burger blowout? So good. Yeah. And of course, we put them on brioche rolls, which you know, makes everything better. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, well, we're going to go up. from David's Recipes, search that on QVC.com to find my veggie burgers, to fruitcake. Now, I know some of you who have never seen this before are, are, are about to go out and get up and go make a sandwich. I'm going to ask you to pump the brakes because this fruitcake is like nothing you've ever tasted before. 200 of these are already gone. This fruitcake is from Beatrice. This is the Beatrice Bakery. Three pounds of some of the most dense, delightful fruitcake. Textured, chewy, creamy, a little bit boozy. I mean, it's really delicious. We sold this out the last time we had it on the air, I believe, is that right, Dan? Yeah, sold out last day presented, and nearly 21,000 cakes ordered this season. Marie Louise Ludwig. First time. Hello. It was a couple years ago, wasn't it? Yes. You came to me before a show and said, David, I'm so excited. I you did. and I are presenting a fruitcake. And what face did I make? <laughs> totally <laughs> did. Because I wasn't sure that people actually made <laughs> fresh fruitcake. I just thought they kept regifting the old ones. Yep, yeah. True. Because fruitcake, historically, mm. not something that was a fave, right? Right. But this comes to us from a very special bakery. Uh huh. And they do fruitcake the uh -huh. right way. Tell us about Beatrice Bakery. This is 100 year old recipe from a beautiful little town in Nebraska, Beatrice, Nebraska, where you have all of these bakers who have pretty much dedicated the last few decades to hand decorating all of these cakes that are loaded with plump candied fruits, fresh nuts, a little bit of bourbon, a little bit of rum, a little bit of brandy, two and a half hours in a slow oven and weeks, weeks to mellow into it. this delicious cake. Look at this, I'm going to break this open, which has, by the way, no citron, no lemon or orange. You want to eat it. Well, exactly, because if you've had fruit cake before and it had a very heavy, uh, heavy taste of orange or of lemon, yeah. It's because a lot of folks that made uh, fruitcake would put that in there because they didn't want to put the expensive ingredients in. Mm -hmm. So they would put that in there hoping it would kind of mask and, and mimic yes. the other flavors when in fact it just took away from the overall flavor. I can tell you this is already popular. In fact, we've now taken orders for 500 cakes are gone. Oh, thank this you. This is extraordinary. You and I sold this out the last time we had it on the we air. We did because you love it. You want to come back over here? I do want to come on this side because I know please, you're right handed. Please, please, Let please. me do it. I'm on this side. Let me also tell you that we are shipping 11 4 or 12 2. 
In fact, the cakes you're ordering today, I'm going to guess, haven't even been baked yet. They have, have they? not. Well, they have not been baked yet, but it's a process. And it is a long and slow process because to get all this fruit and nuts and the cake and get all of the flavors to mellow with the bourbon, rum, and brandy takes weeks in a controlled environment. Okay, so they'll be baked soon. Yes. And but then fresh. they're going to be left to almost ferment, mm -hmm. right? Ferment's probably not the right mm -hmm. word, but they set they, they <laughs> set up mellow, mellow the flavors age. marry and mellow. Now, <laughs> first of all, I want you to see how moist this cake is. When I break this open, what doesn't it do when I squeeze it? it doesn't crumble. Oh. Look at my thumbs. Mm. Do you see them glistening? Because that's the moisture in this cake. And then the flavor. Uh -huh. The texture. Mm -hmm. I couldn't believe it the first time I tasted this cake because I was going to take one for the team that day because I was like, I do not love fruit cake. I do not love it. And then Maria Louise <laughs> gave me this one and it changed my mind. It did. Mm. Plump raisins in there, pineapple, candied Michigan cherries. Here We're we go. Swaying. We are swaying. Bend your knees a little bit. And then go this way uh, and that way. You know why I can do this? I've been using the leg master at home. Ooh. You know that thing that goes like this? <laughs> slides in and out. Yeah, I do it at home. I can tell. Your yeah. swing has gotten so much better. The legs are stronger. <laughs> All right. Mm. This is so good. Now, I don't want you to be nervous about brandy, mm -mm. bourbon, and what was the other one? Rum. Rum. Nope. Because that bakes off in the cooking process. It does. What you're left though is the great flavor that it's that the imparts. essence. And when you open the box, by the way, when you get this home, it's going to come to you in a beautiful package. So good. All wrapped up, freshly baked. There's got, it's not going to be frozen at all. It's going to arrive to you fresh. This cake Beautifully is heavy. boxed. Very, very heavy. It's because of everything that goes into this. This cake is loaded. Every bite is chewy and crisp. And just, oh, they came again. You get <laughs> okay, chewy, crunchy, creamy, flavorful. Uh huh. Explosion on your tongue. Dry, <laughs> uh, dry nuts on top, moist insides. Mm -hmm. And you know what? If you can eat a great big wedge of this, and God bless, but I find that it's a rich cake, it's a dense cake. Yeah. A little piece and some coffee would just be perfect for me. And then I can make this cake last a good long time. Speaking of that, how do we store this cake? Well, when you get it home, you can keep it on your countertop if you're not going to open it up, but you might want to freeze it if you're not going to eat it right away. If you do open it up, then store it in the refrigerator because you've got a lot of fresh things and moisture going on here. Look at that. Oh, the cherries are just popping out. Should we go through down here in the front everything that's loaded into this? You know what? The sodium is really low in this. We've never looked at this before. Enough. Sodium is super low in this. I know. Low sodium, low fat. <laughs> a serving is only seven grams of fat. Yeah, how about that? I tell you what, who would have thought that at Christmas time with cake? So, you know what I want to do? Delightful. What I'm going to do, I'm going to take this opportunity to have everybody rethink the fruit cake because I think a lot of people say they don't like it because somebody else doesn't like it, but they've never tried it. So, come or down here. Or if they've tried it, they've tried that store bought mess that sits around for, you know, six months yeah, at a warehouse. Yeah, that's loaded with lemon and, and orange peel that's all bitter. So, do you like candy cherries? Yes. Have a plump carrot candy cherries from Michigan. Do you like that juicy candy pineapple? Do you like raisins? Now, there's actually two kinds of raisins in here the, the regular raisins. We're used to and the golden plump raisins. How about big crunchy almonds? How about pecans? How about walnuts? Fresh nuts come together, and then if that's not enough, a little bourbon, a little rum, a little brandy to make it interesting. All going into that cake, and then aging that cake after it's baked for two and a half hours to present this. All right. So we're shipping on November the fourth, December the second. Dano, how many are gone now? 2,200 cakes are gone in this presentation. Lots and lots of you are making your choice now. And let's welcome Joanne in Ohio. Joanne, how are you? I'm fine, David. How are you? Doing very well. <laughs> We're glad you dialed in today and talked to us. Have you ever tried the Beatrice Bakery cake? I did. A friend of mine gave me some when she ordered hers. Um, and every time I go to buy a fruit cake, I don't care where it's at, it's like sawdust. And the fruit is hard. Right. So I ordered one of these the last time it was on air when it sold out. I did get through, and I did get one for December the 2nd. I can't wait to get it. Wonderful. But you have tasted this one because a friend had some at their house. Is that right? Yes, I did. And it's absolutely out of this world. Thank you, Joanne. That's what made me order one for myself. 
Thank you. Well, our producer said that when they spoke with you, <laughs> you had indicated to them that this was the best fruit cake you had ever tried? Yes, it is. Wow. I've tried a lot of fruit cake. I'm 78 years old. Okay. I've tried a lot of fruit cake, and I paid a lot of money for fruit cake, and it always dry. I've never tasted a fruit cake as moist and fruity and as good as this one. I'm never. I'm so, so glad. We hear that over and over again. Everybody gets super excited about this. This cake is so moist that Marie can actually ball it up. It's so moist. I know. I'm, watch I'm watching. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Fruit cake balls. It is. Equally it enjoyable. Is. Yeah. I Every just got home. My sister took me shopping this, after this morning, mm -hmm. and I just got home about 20 minutes ago and turned on QVC. And I said, oh, there's the fruitcake I'm getting in December. <laughs> <laughs> Good for you. Thank you so much. Well, Joanne, we're glad you called in and glad you're home after a busy day. And we've got lots more to share with you in this show. And then, of course, David's Big Christmas coming up in about eight minutes from now, okay? Yes, I know, and I'll be watching. Thank you that so much. That sounds great. Thank you so much for your phone call. It's a pleasure meeting you, Joanne. Oh. Thank you. Nice meeting you, too. Thanks, bye -bye. love. Be well. Bye-bye. You, too. Bye. We're very, very busy for the season now. We've sold over 24,000 cakes. Wow. Here's all I have left. <laughs> 1,500 that can ship in December and 700 in November. And then look at, it's over. Look at all the cherries. Look at that. Oh, I'm so excited. She's okay, go. Go to Odina so I can cherries. eat. Cherries. Oh they remind God. me of my grandmother's cherry in the bottom of her Manhattan drink when I was little. Yes, indeed. Well, this was not too far off. Uh uh. Um, Hello, Grandma. Because there's some, some delicious, mm. you know, spirits up in there. <laughs> all right. Let's come over here and we're going to welcome back Adina Michio. She's going to round out our show. Let's do it. With enrobed brownies and collectible cookie jars. Mm. Mwah. Great to be here. Thank now, you. Now, one for thing that me. you may not be aware, having watched QVC probably most of you for a long time, our sister channel, HSN, used to be home of David's Cookies for how many years? We were actually there for over, I was there for over 12 years, 15 years at HSN. And one thing that you all did down there on a pretty regular basis were these collectible cookie jars. Yes. And every year they were different. Mm -hmm. And in fact, you've sold on HSN and QVC combined now over 1 million cookie Can jars. Can you imagine? That's quite a lot. Cookie jar collectors, because really this is what you want. You want the treat. But you want the keepsake. And we have done it this year with our metallic inspiration. And everyone, everyone backstage, everyone who takes a real look at this can't believe that these are full functioning, ceramic, food safe cookie jars. Our tree standing, David, nearly a foot tall with that silicone seal. And then the present, which has been wildly popular. Now, what's inside is even more popular. And we're yes. talking about the enrobed brownies. When David's Cookies makes a brownie, the same care and attention they pay to cookies, they pay to brownies. Yeah. But these brownies are double thick. Yes. They're super moist. Yes. Because you actually melt chocolate into we these do. brownies. We do. We do. We use pure melted down chocolate in each and every brownie. These are all, as you can see, handmade because no two are alike. These are our super sized, if you will. So we're going to take that pure melted down chocolate. We're going to incorporate the whole eggs, the pure cane sugar, the fresh Dutch cocoa. We're going to enrobe them. We're going to drizzle them. We're going to individually wrap, wrap them, them. And then we're going to place them inside either your gift box or your tree. Or your tree. In fact, we're calling this the present. Yes. Sorry, and calling present. the other the tree. Yes. Now, I will tell you, you may have these delivered again. I know I sound like a broken record. November 4th, December 2nd. That's when all of our food's going to be shipping out for holiday this year. So uh, you're not going to be billed for this until it actually ships, either in November or December. A great gift idea because then the cookie jar can continue to live its life as a holiday cookie jar in years to come, or it can just be a beautiful sit about decoration. Right. Because these are done with the metallic paints and they're absolutely exquisite. The quality is fantastic. Thank you. And that is what we're known for, David. That's why nearly, again, one million cookie jar collectors can't be wrong. This year we've adorned the top of your present with what's inspired by jingle bells. But I love this, David, because look at the size of this jar. So is it your K-cups that you're looking to store? Is it a bag of flour or sugar? Because of that silicone seal, you can actually use this for anything. In fact, look what we've even done here. Because again, doesn't need to be wrapped. 
it's completely food safe. Oh, with the moose munch. So your moose munch, your germac nuts, you name it, you're enjoying it. <laughs> Let's get in here and have some of your brownie. Please do. Mm. Mm. Oh, wow. I know. Big, thick brownie. Is that like, um, it's a chocolate coating, isn't yeah. it? Almost like yeah. Yeah. Exactly. And we do that ever so lightly, purposely. We want you to enjoy that delicious brownie. So the chocolate on top is just a light mm. bath, if you will, of chocolate and then drizzled with Enough the white chocolate. Enough to hold it together, exactly. Exactly. Now, this is very, very popular, and we're very busy here at the tail end of our show. Uh, only about three minutes remaining, a little less than that. And so everyone's going to love these. They're individually wrapped. And now remember, your brownies are going to be fresh. Oh, yeah. So it's important to know the brownies you order today haven't even been baked yet. They're going to be baked closer to the time that you ship out 11 4 or 12 2. We just had some bake for our presentation today, so we'd be able to show you. Exactly. What was going on. Actually, do you know that we're not even making them? Because, of course, this is the time where our enrolled brownies aren't even available. Because of the heat, yeah, we don't even make them. Bake anywhere, them. Yeah, but until much closer to time. Do you know, I was showing you, David, the details of the jars. I just want you to understand full size works of art. We've even hand decorated the skirt, if you will, below of your Christmas tree. So maybe if you know someone, Who's no longer setting up a Christmas tree because whether they're in assisted living or it's just too much work? What a great way to let them appreciate the season. Now, the present being delivered in December is super, super popular. So please don't wait on that. I think a lot of folks are thinking about that for the holidays. The tree is also very popular. So just pick this up either for delivery in November on the 4th or December on the 2nd. We do not and will not bill your card until these actually ship. Correct. And that's going to be fantastic. If you love David's cookies, the same care and attention goes into their brownies. Oh, yeah. And this is something very, very special. Stay on the line for these. They are H63732. You get 16 of the enrobed brownies and this beautiful ceramic metallic painted cookie jar. Exactly. 1,200 of these are now gone. Thank and Dina Michio, you. a pleasure, Thank Angel. Thank you. Thank you. Mwah. Enjoy your I appreciate your you jars. so much. Gonna head over this way, catch up with Ali Cars. I think we're gonna join back over here about the TV, my darling. Oh. I got you a little something. Oh, good. Is that the right size? They filled it with moose munch coffee. No. Perfect. I can they fit don't. inside of that one. But you know what you can do? <laughs> you can use it to help when you say this. Join me coming up next for David's Big Christmas. Boy, that was loud, wasn't that, it? That you nailed it. <laughs> David's Big Christmas. It's a big show. It needs a big mug. Hey, uh, Ed, what you got there? 200 new customers during our three hours of food. How was the chat today, darling? The chat was great. Yeah? We're loving the fruitcake. A lot yes. of good sweet treats, too. Well, I hope everyone's going to stick around because yeah. we have an hour of David's Big Christmas. Everything is for pay or better in the show. Ooh. You're also going to see some brand new goodies we did not see during Christmas in July. And some really exciting things to kind of amp up your holiday decorating. Because what's the name of the show? David's Great Big Christmas. Ed is That's loud correct. in there. That's correct. Kind of We're back in moments. Would you help me with my apron? Yeah. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> She's so good. Fall in love with the